Hi, I'm Kefana Koltora. I'm an Ariani wood elf. I am perhaps a bit innocent at times, but I truly believe the best of everyone. Kindness is incredibly important to me, as is helping others. That's why I started studying natural medicine. I can absolutely be stubborn, but I will do everything possible to help and protect my family, blood or otherwise. Hi, my name is Quint Essential. I can most often be found lost in thought and contemplation. I'm a Loxodon monk with a gentle disposition, a gentle giant, if you will. So don't let my calm exterior fool you. A lifetime of martial training will ensure the first time you cross my friends will be the last. I am Redeemer, also known as XO21. I am a Warforged Paladin who exudes both confidence and strength. I am driven by a desire to return to my true place in both time and space. I possess a strong sense of vengeance and justice, but often come across as unfeeling or insensitive. However, I am both loyal and caring to anyone who earns my trust. Hi, I'm Terrace Tealeaf. Folks say I'm very intense despite my diminutive stature. Is that some kind of backhanded compliment for being so short? I'm a halfling and a druid, and I love apples. I'm curious and inquisitive, but honestly, I nix most opportunities to socialize with people. But I do have good stories to share at a campfire. I'm never far from Micah. She's a southern baboo cowl who travels with me. And both of us prefer the company of other animals over people. Being the caretaker of Pocket Dimension Pie is an all time job. No, you didn't hear me wrong. Not full time, it's all the time. I am Ordrio. Caretaker of Park Dimension Pie, a multi-dimensional complex station nestled within the weaves of the fabric of time, space, and reality. With the aid of PyBot, the AI and brain of Park Dimension Pie, our top priority is the stability and safety of the multiverse. PyBot has scanned so much log data for countless worlds, dimensions, and timelines, they tend to exhibit something almost unrecognizable to their original program. Personality. Hi everyone, uh, welcome to another episode of Pocket Dimension Pi. Um, just a quick reminder, the cast, um, we're not able to, to play along and, and um, chat with you while we're while we're in character because a we'll lose character and b there's enough distractions going on without us like watching everything else um it's not that we don't love you we love you incredibly much thank you so much for being here um this is literally just a uh, it's to give you guys the best experience um but please do roll your dice along with us there are special commands in chat if someone can run exclamation dnd commands you will see all of the various things that you can run uh while we are playing and uh at that point i'm gonna hand over to pi hi hello um welcome <laughs> uh so last session that we were in uh, you all met maximilius the frog lord um in the sewers you went back to Denold's to um, check on Bram. Um, you were told that Bram's fine. He's he's made a recovery. Then you went to go see Merlin, um, and you told him about the the frog pendant that you found. Um, he looked at it, and he's currently researching the cure or or a reversal um, of. The curse that's currently on maximilius then you all went back down into the sewer and teamed up with him and now you're on your way to uh find out what's going on in the sewers it just went black went at me it just went black at yeah. me as well yeah. there we go. <laughs> okay. the sewers went dark no <laughs> I have dark vision. The <laughs> They're essentially reverse lights. So, uh. all right. So, quick question: uh, Do you want me to go into the big map, or do you want to just use the little one while we're just traversing the sewers? Um, look, little one's fine until we go into combat. So, yep. 
Easy. I have scrolled up. Oh, never mind. I forgot we made a treaty. Never mind. We're good. <laughs> I was like, I've had enough of killing frogs. Uh, no, we can command the frogs now. It's yeah, fine. No, we're good. Okay. Never it's mind. It's fine. They will do. It. Oh, in fact, maybe we can use them to to aid us if we get in trouble. An and interesting these are frogs at our command. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna. Oh, I can't. The game is paused. I was gonna. There we go. Thank you. I'm gonna keep walking. Yeah. Um, I mean, I just. So were we going north? Or yes. Yeah. Did we come in from? We were. No, we're we're um, going north. I think Maximilian's leading the way. Maximilius? Max, 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 Max. 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 Oh, <laughs> let's go. It's Max. Maximilius <laughs> um, is kind of leading the way. And I'm on the other side. Uh, luckily, I made the jump across the mess. <laughs> that was a, it was a little mucky last time, wasn't it? Um, I'm just going to pat the frog on the on the head gently as we as we go by. Um, I don't know it if the frog eyes is... you hungrily. Um, I'm going to snatch my hand back. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'd uh, jump in, across in the to the other side. You hear a soft play of hungry eyes. <laughs> well, look at you, but I can't decide I've got. Hmm. I love it. I love it. <laughs> um, I'll... Pass if you're there. That clip's for you. <laughs> I'll try and uh, jump, jump. Well, try and get past this frog to see what's to the left, um, and and wait to see what Maximilius and the others do. Okay. Um, roll roll perception for me. I mean, that's not a bad start for me. Twenty-one. That is a pretty there you go. decent start. For that is a that, nice yeah. roll. <laughs> you I'll see nearly that. everything. Yeah. <laughs> Those so, robotic um, eyes coming in handy. <laughs> You can see through the wall. No, um, so <laughs> you, you you basically see a a gate, um, and in the middle of the gate is uh, what appears to be um, an emblem of a lion, um, but it's 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 locked, um, and it looks like there's a a key that goes to that. Is this the same emblem that was on the door that Merlin is behind? It is. Yeah, is that also that. a lion? It's not. Okay. Not. Okay. So, so this this here is the where the door is, right? Where I just pinged. That's correct. Okay, good. <laughs> um, okay. Uh... I would like to look to the right. What do I see to the right? There's almost this look of panic in Pi's eyes. <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, what do I see to the right? And he's like, really? Oh, <laughs> I was prepped. Oh. Roll, roll initiative. Oh. Or, roll roll initiative. Like, let me, let me Are we all in rage for initiative already? <laughs> yeah. Just, I looked to the right and we're rolling initiative. I looked. I didn't do anything. Um, seeing as we're going straight into a combat right now for brevity, uh, and just to keep it clear, I would have told the others that there's a door here that uh, seems to be locked. <laughs> so, yeah. Just everybody knows there's no meta gaming in future. If uh, if somebody's like, oh, wasn't there a door that needed a key? <laughs> uh -oh. Are these so? It looks on the map like these frogs are asleep, but are they? Can we ask the frogs to help us? I mean, they're just snoozing. I mean, yeah, well, I'm just trying to move forward eyes. so I can see. Hungry eyes. It's gonna be in my head for weeks, man. Yep. So we Except I'm seeing initiative. it as the Hungry oh, Jacks yeah. ad. Oh yeah, initiative. Um. <clears throat> That's probably the best initiative I've ever rolled. Every time I roll initiative, is always low. That's shocking. Oh. Yeah. Why can't I see that? That's. There? Nice. Whoa. Incredible. Well done, Max. Um, I'm going to ask him at this point. Um, is there any chance your uh, frog friends could help us out? Apparently I got a um, toe. Just, just the one with the hungry eyes. 
Okay. <laughs> That would be appreciated. I forgot about the voice. This is amazing. <laughs> oh, man. Trying to not spill soup all over my bed. Probably for the best. All right, seeing as we're in combat, give me a second. Oh, no. Oh, yay. No, wait, they're an ally. No. <laughs> <laughs> that was a wrong. The frog's just like looking at the ground, just face into the ground. Like, I don't want to be here. <laughs> Not even thought to be here today. Um, <laughs> totally one of those cats who just like lies down, like not nah, face palm, like face into the ground. I'm done. <laughs> also, oh, I'm really sorry to anyone who can hear Monster having a epic sulk beside me. No, I couldn't hear her fine. until you said that. <clears throat> Monster's fine. Right, so I guess Terrace goes first. Uh, I think Maximilius goes first. Uh, you had a plus to your oh, initiative. Um, Maximilius doesn't appear yeah. to. He's got plus his, three. He's at 23, yeah. Oh, right, okay, sorry. I had to manually... Um, I had to manually put it in, so I just put a 20. There we go. Uh, um, apologies. So he's... I'm trying to remember. There we go. There's my pop out. Yeah, I always forget about that. I was like, where's the initiative? I can't see it. It's broken. I'm just trying to figure out where to put it so that everyone else can see it as well. Ah, uh, I see. Mm, if something is an action, does that mean that I can't? use an action. So instead of attacking on my turn, I have to do mm -hmm. the thing. Yep. Mm, okay. Okay. Alternatively, depending on how far away you are and such, your action can be used to sprint and stuff. So you can double the distance you can move. But that also takes an action. Unless you're a rogue. Yeah, unless you're one of those cheeky boys. I just forget that just because I personally would never run doesn't mean Kathana doesn't necessarily run. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, you could sprint, and I'm like, I'd rather die. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose that might not be the case for her. I heard the noise, but I didn't see anything. Yeah, he must have privately okay. rolled some dice. <laughs> no, I, I mean, I don't mean to. My thing's this public rule, but um, <laughs> this snake takes three points of damage. So. Which snake? Uh, the snake. <laughs> You're so this far one. from us. What, what? What is Max able to do from that distance? Uh, vicious, vicious mockery. mockery. Yep. Oh, nice. Yeah. What did he do? What did he say? What did he say? Yeah, I want I want this. <laughs> oh, um he's just like yeah. why'd it have to be snakes? Why'd it have to be snakes? Why'd it have to be snakes? And he's like just Yeah. <laughs> Herman arms swelling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. He's like, oh jeez, why'd it have to be snakes? Why did it be snakes? And he's just playing his guitar or uh loot. <laughs> oh, he's like that is the end of his turn, which I did not begin. And there we go. Okay, Here's... I I have I have some physics questions. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, here we go. Oh dear. Uh, that doorway gate thing that Redeemer pointed out. How wide is it? Mm -hmm. Is it two squares or one uh, square? Yes. Well, it's it. It technically goes the entire way because it's it's like i guess not concrete but uh just like uh mortar and brick to the middle and then there's a gate so 10 10 feet uh, sweet so terrace is gonna look at that raise an eyebrow look at the snakes and then just shift. She's gonna allow it all to just come back. She's gonna just 
become a brown bear wearing that little pouch on her arm at her knee like it's the 90s and she's got a little zip pouch on her wrist um, which has the chrono finder in it because she's made that mistake once and never again um, so yeah there is just suddenly this this whopping great big brown bear um, which I believe is a bonus action how much sewage is there Pi? is she really a poo bear oh no <laughs> just out of curiosity <laughs> yes Oh, fun. Absolutely. Just yes. Fabulous. Just yes. I want, I want the so artwork I'm... where there's a brown bear with a red shirt on. Ah, yeah. <laughs> and feet caked in crap. Right, uh. yes. We need, yeah. the, we need the second layer in there. Also. Are we requesting fan art or are we requesting me yes. to draw stuff? Fan art. Fan art? All right. Fan art. <laughs> all of right. the above right you know all right so while that uh well shape is 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 a uh is a bonus action cool so i'm gonna move forward and attack it can i <clears throat> oh sorry one second i'm just trying to find the right oh no for this what's that i don't know if i can reach it for initiative already. <laughs> They're all... Ah, how did I get rid of that? Why did that happen that way? I'm glad to know you did that and not me. Why am I so shit at the... Oh my god. Pie. <laughs> <laughs> One green go. square with a circle was too much. Let me add a sec. <sighs> Why won't it let me... There we go. Got it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh my god. Mm, right. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Do we need another counter? Red red messes up the VTT. <laughs> oh dear. What's, what's wrong now? We need, we need a counter for me messing up the VTT for everyone. Oh. Um, Alright. What I was trying to do was measure. Is it this one? Aha, it's that one. It's the ruler. <laughs> um, alright. So shocking. <laughs> there are two rulers. Oh, that's Being true. Fair. Like a right angle. I I picked the right angle one. Hmm. It was the first This ruler time I or saw. the first time? Just now. Well the, when I messed up everything. The wrong time. Okay. Yes, the wrong time. <laughs> oh! Actually, my speed increases when I'm the bear, so we're fine. Everything's Bears fine. are faster than half size humans. To be fair, Terrace actually has decent speed for being so tiny. Yeah, I just mean a bear's legs are longer. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sitting here like, hi, I'm sorry. Making you change my token. Big old bear token. I'm debating. Comes off the screen. Yeah, that's a valid apology. That's fair. No need to add it. <laughs> no, no, that's not it. This, this is... Nope. Red I, muted. I'll I'll have to get a new uh, bear token. I have cause... now got no token and no presence and. <gasps> Gone forever. 
uh, I has been deleted. Whatever the spell you cast. You're is. in the list, though. I am still on the list, indeed, but uh, the VTT is blank. You transformed into a spirit, and we just can't see you. That's all that is. Are you a ghost? Well, I am now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, while while we wait for this, uh, if if anybody is in our discords, uh, the Pocket Dimension Pie category has a clips channel. Mm -hmm. There are already several clips from tonight and a gif. That doesn't surprise me. <laughs> oh, you mood. waving your arms. That's so, so good. I love it. <laughs> I muted the channel, but now I need to unmute. <laughs> that is fantastic. That's some quick walk. Quick walk? Work, Troy. <laughs> That's right, quick work. Troy is so good at it. Troy is the MVP, yeah. honestly. Honestly. Wow. So spoiled. All right, the sulking dog has moved. She has decided that she is not going to sulk at my feet. She's going to sulk against the wall. And her sulk has progressed to, I'm not talking to you. No, no. <laughs> oh, no. It's a full on sulk. So while we're waiting for, for um, everything to unbreak, um, I'm, I am going to say, let's look at chat and let's talk to people while the game is <laughs> technically paused. Technically. Um, so. <laughs> right that. Note to self, wild shaping is a jerk move. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, I was all prepared and then you went and did that. Gotta give it to him. He's really what? They pulled a whole hype train? <laughs> Damn, I wasn't even there. <laughs> I know. Holy was... crumbs. NVC DM with the, the 10 gifted to oh, start. Wow. Like, Hang on. Amaris on, no, resubbing. Thank you, sweetheart. NVC with the 10 gifted mm -hmm. subs. You incredible human. Thank you. Uh, Cass with 100 bits. Thank you. Has he stopped with 100 bits as well? You guys are amazing and incredible. Thank you greatly. I will not stop. I mean, <laughs> I you will weren't go. supposed to be in the chat. You weren't I will to be go, there. not stop. It's the whole... I'm just glad that there isn't a Tassie wait. See, you give us ideas. <laughs> My travel hashtag is uh, T-A-Z-I-G-O-G-O. -O. Tassie go-go. Of go. course it go -go. is. Are you trying to be that Welsh place? You know, the one with the go-go-go at the end. Have you, heard, no. have you heard that? Oh, you haven't heard that. Oh, a lot of people shorten I... it to the. Come on. Oh, I thought you were asking, have I heard of that place? I was like, Para has a whole redeem. I've heard it oh, many times. A... Well, some people call it, refer to it as like, you know, the Flan Go Go Go. <laughs> so, like, uh... yeah, people ruin the end of it. Uh... Never mind. Wasted on all of you. It's fine. It's fine. Did you say Para has a redeem for it? Yeah. That's fantastic. There's a points redeem and then he'll say it. They'll say it at you. I'm just giving it away for free. I need to stop there. <laughs> <laughs> yes, because that's... <laughs> no, I'm just going to stop. I'm just going <laughs> to... just going to not. Probably for the best. Whoa. That wave terrace is giant. Is... Okay, are we good that to go? Big terrace. Sorry, I was just fixing yep. something in Discord. Oh, terrace is gone. Terrace is back. Terrace is a dragon. Yeah. Terrace Hansa. is not a... in the uh, combat. It's the track. beast icon from DD Beyond. Ah, uh, I was like, oh, I like that. Panther? Panther? Is that a panther? Yeah, the files that are loaded don't have bear like it's listed in it but when you load it it's this so um next time do you want me to draw you a bear we know what do you want, do you want me to do you want me to draw myself as a bear um, the terrace bear with a little it. couch on go her arm do it terrible at drawing bears let's go <laughs> it's, it's got to be doing this it's got to be doing this yeah <laughs> yes um all right. All right. Back to it. 
<laughs> but just so that you're aware, cool. Terrace has had the um, initiative shifted. Initiative reset. I they was twenty one. Twenty one. They were after Max, before me. Everybody is after Max. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. All right. Uh, so I wild shaped. Uh, and I'm gonna move 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, yes! To there! <laughs> and I'm gonna attack it. Um, <laughs> now I get... I get multi-attack, but I'm gonna go okay. with pause first. Do it. I think. Yeah. Balls first. I'm basically going to stomp it. I was just Ooh. thinking, how much bigger than these snakes are you? Like, the... <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah, how big are these snakes? Because if they're the same... If they're taking up a square... That... It's a really broad category of snake size we could get into, but all of it is big. I mean... I mean, they are giant poisonous snakes. Well, my my next question was, what type of snake are they? Are they poisonous or are they are they are they venomous or are they uh, pythons? But uh, they the are venomous. Restrictors. Yeah. Um. Right. So, does twenty five hit? It does. Uh. So thirteen damage. As yeah. I basically and come down and stomp it with my claws out. Yeah. It it it, it just basically flattens and there's like no you know, uh, rise in the parts that flattened. Uh, there's a little bit of wriggling in between uh, just from nerves, but um, that snake is dead. Sweet. Wow. <laughs> Sadly, All that right. was my entire movement to get here, I think. I was there. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. I can still move five feet. Can I move down one? Yeah. And I'm going to bite that one. <laughs> I'm it. just going to lean down and try to chomp it. No, oh, I can't see what you rolled. We can't see what we you rolled. See what we rolled. just see your face. Yeah. Yeah. It says Dragon Kier privately rolled some dice. I think you rolled a 20, given I the excitement. But, I did yeah. roll a 20. You should be able to see my rolls. They're set to public. <laughs> The public private thing is really reliable. <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah, I I I, I natty twentied. Nice. Do you do you wanna describe what you did? Uh so basically I I stomped on the first one by just like going like that, looked over to the right, saw there's another one, and then just sort of pounced but went for it with my mouth instead of its cl my claws to make it think I was going to go for it with claws and I, I grabbed it with my mouth as it tried to get out of the way um, and I basically just bit it directly behind the back of its head and then shook it like a crocodile would uh, and then spat it out <laughs> probably doesn't taste <laughs> <like it. laughs> I wonder what tastes worse snake or vampire supposedly snake tastes quite good um, well but they're toxic yeah, but you're not eating the toxic bit. They're venomous, they're not poisonous. You can bite them safely, it's if they bite you, it's not safe. But, um, I, I was going to go with these <laughs> ones probably taste good. worse because they're in the sewer. Right, right, exactly. Well, that's true. Just because, yeah. Ooh. Oh, yeah, Which is why I spat it out. <laughs> poopy covered. Well, that one's on the side, just to be fair. Mm. Which is why I stomped on that one and beat this one. <laughs> Science and logic. Physics. Um, <laughs> so there goes physics. that fight. That was fun. <laughs> um, Terrace, roll a perception check for me. Oh no. Hey, if you had more snakes. <laughs> Snake queen is coming. She's getting <laughs> just one bite, Terrace. <laughs> 22. Oh. Okay. Um, you, you see a, a shine underneath the snake that you bit um and as as you look closer at it it is um basically an emblem of a, a lion's head 
Is it in the paving, or is it a? No, no. It's it, it's just a a small like uh, it's it's uh, just like like a trinket. So. Do I need to roll dexterity to see if I can pick it up? Or <laughs> no, do bears it's... have the ability to like? Are you allowing this brain bear to just scoop? Um, you have a mouth. <laughs> bit of snake. <laughs> bit of snake, you can bite a key. <laughs> Go. <laughs> Just <laughs> the reaction was priceless. Red has two or three regrets, most of them being an overactive imagination. <laughs> <laughs> Terrace just like puts both her paws down and and leans and just tries to pick it up with her mop loose like really really delicately how big is it it's it's, it's about the size of like <laughs> someone's palm you know key sized All you guys can see is just this really dejected, <laughs> dejected sort of like really happy that I've killed everything, and then all of a sudden, <sighs> and then just walks over and just like trudges, <laughs> trudges over. Who's who's first? I'm gonna give it to Kathana. I'm going to walk over and then just like nose you in the shoulder and like bare my teeth. I hold out my hands to accept the bear gift. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh. I wonder if this could go in that door. Redeemer, does it look like I'm... it could go in that door? <laughs> I'm gonna go back and look down those two Yeah. Two bits. I wanna see what's down there. Like is there anything else? Waggies. Um you you see two two more frogs. Um and then what looks to be a similar gate to the other side. So it could be either gate that opens. <clears throat> or both. Or both. I wonder if they've keyed it alike. It's a lot cheaper. All right. Um, I'm sure expense was the top of their concern list. Hey, look, rich people can be really cheap. Mm, it's how they're rich. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try and walk really delicately so I stay on the path. <laughs> oh man. Oh. <laughs> just Actually, like, le leaning into the wall and like just pushing against it so you But don't I'm gonna fall. shake all of it off that I picked it up before before I come over here. Like I'm not gonna do it. Actually no, I am. I'm gonna do it beside Kithana. Oh, now no. that I've handed her the key, I'm gonna shake all the shit off. Oh no! Thanks. So well, uh, luckily, you would only be in here. Can, can I oh, roll an acrobatics no, or a dexterity check to dodge this? <laughs> I don't feel like I've got enough in the in front of me to uh, prevent from getting covered. <laughs> oh dear. Um, I guess roll 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 a dex <laughs> roll a dex save. A dex save. Yeah, thank <laughs> God for that. Sixteen. Okay, you, you good? Oh, thank God for that. I think I've Hungry. accepted my fate. Hungry eyes frog just looks a little disappointed. There. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Right, who has the key? Is it? I have it. Keith Arnold. Keith Arnold. Oh, God. Congrats no one picked it chat, up when please. I did it before. Oh, 
no one did it. No one, no one noticed. It's no, like, you see, with on. your accent, it sounds the same. <laughs> <laughs> K-Thana and Key-Thana only sound different <laughs> with an American vowel. <laughs> Um, all right, I'm going to head towards this door and see okay. if the key fits. Okay, um, you, I guess, place I the, the the lion's head trinket into the, uh, I guess, fitting, and the door unlocks and opens, and... Nice. I carefully remove it and put it back in my pocket. Sure. I don't want to lose it in this. <laughs> More schnicks. God damn it. <clears throat> well, sure. Oh, First we were on a frog clearing mission and now we're on a snake clearing mission. Let's do this. Wait, should we maybe try and talk to these snakes? You know, like how Maximilius said we should talk <laughs> to the frogs. I mean, look, anyone... Max, Max was the one to start the, the round of attacks before. I think if if these, point. yeah, if these were going to be friendly, I think Max would have opened with talking. Maybe, maybe the snakes and the frogs are two opposite factions. Maybe there's a, a snake Emilius somewhere down here. Oof. Max has gone from leading the pack to rolling a one. That really sucks. Leader of the pack. Oh. Hmm. Wow, all those dice just jumped at the same time on my screen. <laughs> Ah, sorry. I got a four, but I failed to collect my token. I'm sorry. Let me try it again. Or do you just want to add me with the four? Oh wait, yeah, I did the same thing, did I? I'm not in the list. Um, I, I got the did, seven. Did Did you roll on D and D Beyond? Or... I didn't uh, have we, my token. We hadn't selected our tokens. Yeah. I oh, I feel okay. like it's unfair. I just got another natty twenty. Um. <laughs> Which is really cool, but also it's not actually my initiative. <laughs> unless you want to allow it. Um, yeah, that's fine. Uh, let's see. There you go. Mine's this time well. we have two frog friends. That's exciting. I like this <laughs> list. <laughs> Mine, I would have been in pretty much the same position anyway, because I rolled a seven before. I guess me and the frog could have had a roll off. But... I think this will be fine. Uh -huh. And there we go. Okie dokie. I'm in favor of Terrace doing the same thing again. <laughs> go Run right in. ahead. <laughs> Kill a snake. Jump in. <laughs> Jump on and or bite 30, some snakes. 35. Let's go. You can literally do the exact same moveset if you wanted. I again. just charge I right the feck in. And uh, okay. I, I did the same. I pounce on it with my claws. As you go splashing through the muck, Redeemer's gonna like hold the cloak up. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just been by, clean. By this point, it's just like a little like napkin compared to the rest of you. <laughs> Twenty-two to hit. Oh. Yep. Oh, wow. Um, and thirteen slashing damage. Oof. Yep. You you essentially just slash this snake in half um, as it just kind of like falls to the ground. Yeah. Quinn is starting to, think that Terrace, to the left and bite this one. Quinn is, starting, Quinn is starting to think that Terrace has a vendetta against snakes. How vicious mm. this has been. <laughs> See, I'm imagining like a dog who's trying to catch a hedgehog. Mm. Just like Hi. pouncing on it, like, I can get it for you. <laughs> this 15 hit. Uh, 15 does hit, yep. Uh, six piercing damage. Okay. Um, it, it, it kind of reels, but it, it's, it's still writhing. Oh, this snake's a powerful one. And I spat it out because it's, it's in the It's the, the chosen one. <laughs> Snake just sticks two fangs in and GG. GK. GK. And that's me, that's my turn. I don't have a bonus action as a bear. <laughs> I only remember that because that clip comes up. So... <laughs> I need to make it into a t-shirt. Hmm. 
All right, giant frog, you got this, buddy. Red, you need. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Um. So this this frog just goes over here and starts eating this snake. <laughs> the dead one. <laughs> <laughs> so helpful. <laughs> <laughs> Understandable. Valid yeah. choices, my friend. Yes. <laughs> oh, no. Wait. Based on what we know, that snake is now going to end up in front of Maximilius. That one that just got eaten. Well, but it's dead, so. Yeah, but it's been fe it's feeding them to Maximilius. So. Frogs got to eat. Frogs have got to eat. Yeah, that's true. Okay. It's Keith on his turn. <laughs> um, I'm not gonna bother with the Twilight Sphere. One, two, one, two, it's three, four. Once per short rest, anyway, right? So yeah, it's not worth it right off, now. You're better off saving it for one, me. two, three, four, five. I'm just going to come over here and chill. Hi, should I know that there's a blue circle here? Yep. Okay. Well, I mean. When you eventually address the blue circle. Okay. Um. That's all I can do. Next. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Quinn is going to run and deftly jump around the bear, or at least attempt to. And we are going to... Yeah, we're going to attack the snake, as we should. Uh... Okay. The 19 hit. It hits. Very good. Six damage. With my powerful fists. <laughs> are you basically bludgeoning the snake to death? Fantastic. Oh, I'm just envisioning like this very not like not a king hit but like coming down on top of its head and squishing it into the ground. It 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 gets squished into something. I don't know if it's necessarily the <laughs> oh, no. oh, A point. Oh, no. A yeah. point. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm regretting I'm regretting that. Uh... <laughs> It's going to be another long night of cleaning again. Oh, no. Not again. Mm. I have to go see Merlin. <laughs> Get him to clean us up. <laughs> and and that's the end of combat. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was so fun. So <laughs> far, Redeemer's just kind of gone. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> As this bear, like, runs around. by. Just looking Wait, around for any other... Away to my... Anything else to, like... Attack. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm like looking for anything. I'm gonna roll for anything or. Yeah, I'm gonna look left, mm -hmm. look right, look left again, then cross. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> okay. Um, so, I guess to, to your right, um, you see another gate. Um, By right, you mean up? Uh, yes, sorry. Okay. Um, <laughs> I was like, because the little token's right is in a right. wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so, to the north, you you see another gate. Um, roll perception. I assume I can move up a little bit. I'll just, like, try and jump over the frog and... Yeah, you you can leapfrog. I see several. Um, <laughs> leapfrog, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, so you see, uh, basically, the, like it it looks like uh, a dragon, um, and it's it's blue, um, and to the right of it, you see basically a a, a blue shimmer, um, and and there's what looks to be a similar trinket to. Um, the one that was found previously. I head over to the Shimmer. Okay. Um, so you you pick it up, and it, it looks almost identical. Um, the only difference is this this time it's a it's a dragon instead of a, a lion's head. Um, 
Okay. Well, I think I found the key to this door, guys. Nice work. What's behind door number two? Right. I was. Well, I was going to say what's down. What was south? Because that south. was. Okay. Um. And as you go south, uh, there are more frogs. Oh. Does Maximilian know his way around? Like, should he tell us where? Well, I guess him. if things are locked, he doesn't Art, know. Art. Yeah, I was going to say, Art, are you asking him or are you asking me? <laughs> I'm asking him. I feel like he should be taking a more active role in, because he was leading us to a place. Yeah, um, but then we just started he, going murdering sneaks <laughs> everywhere. To, to be fair, you asked him to join you in finding... I guess what is going on in the sewers <clears throat> and to help him find a, a cure for his curse. He didn't say he was going to lead you. Okay. That is fair. What do you suggest next, Max? Um not sure. I've I've not made it this far. I'm just gonna go up to the door gate thing. He's, he's like Snake's kind of give it. me the heebie-jeebies. That okay. explains well, why you. If there's only frogs down, yeah. If there's only frogs down, I'm heading up. I'm gonna use that dragon key. There's only frogs down as far as we can see, right? Is there? I, I yeah, but it, nothing's gonna there. fight us this second. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh. oh. Okay. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. How? Hmm. Is that a nine square? Is yeah. that a 15 by 15 foot frog? Well, I'm a large creature. What's that, huge? Oh, yeah. Extra large? You just found Mama Snake. Super like... sized? She's gonna be mad. We bit her babies. Oh my god, so mm -hmm. we've moved off the Allen's snakes and we've gone into the Allen's killer pythons. Oh, dear. That is such an Aussie reference that no, I, yeah, no idea what you just... I was gonna say that makes nothing no sense to me. I don't right, know. Right, care packages oh, coming oh. in the post. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Alan's snakes are about that long. Killer right. pythons would be like Keep going? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. and they're about oh. three snakes wide. <laughs> and <laughs> it's so like it's a food? Thick, thick it's a lolly. Yeah, it's it's are, like a glucose. These are lolly snakes. Got yeah. it. I thought you were Do trying to tell snakes? me that an actual killer snake is this big, and I was like, I just don't oh, think look, that's intimidating. No, no, they are. We have. We I have bet snakes, snakes are like, small. small. Yeah. Juvenile, juvenile also, dugites are some of the, the more poisonous versions of dugites because juveniles are more aggressive, so they're more likely to kill you. Yeah, but also, why would you mail us snakes? That seems... <laughs> Uh, <laughs> no, that seems like the end of a friendship. At the point that I said I was going to mail it, why did you think I was actually talking about a real snake? I didn't well, think look, real I mean, snake, but... Stranger I... things have happened. Clicking my token. Pressing oh, the initiatives. Oh, no. I am firmly sitting around we the mid... We rolled a one. To... Yeah. No, mid I'm... to low for initiative today. I am not rolling well for initiative. There are so many ones and twenties getting rolled today. Is any has anyone been running the counters? Please say please people have been running the counters. Also, uh add warning four minutes. Four minute warning, okay. I love the green eyes on this snake. I'm gonna zoom in now. <laughs> Pardon me when I zoom while I zoom in. Oh, it does have little green eyes. How cute. Yeah. So you didn't compliment big. the frog's hungry eyes. That's not nice. So we sang well, about them instead. Hungry yeah. eyes. Also, what color are the frog's eyes? Are they? I know that Brand. I don't think hungry is a color. Mm -hmm. Um, deep purple. Deep. Oh, that's <laughs> way better. Ooh. Is there smoke on the water now? I was. Yeah, I was waiting for that. <laughs> <laughs> smoke on the water. Um. All right. I feel like oh. half this game is us setting you up for clips. <laughs> what's what's the other half? A little bit storytelling. A little bit. Puns. 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 Yeah. Puns. Puns and dad jokes. I wonder what the difference is technically between a pun and a dad joke. They probably just overlap. Puns are essentially a play on words. 
you know, like you get those. I don't know what they're called. You get those graphs where you got like a circle and this would be the Venn the diagram. Circle. diagram. Yeah, where you got the dad jokes. There's a massive overlap with those two. <laughs> um, so, so this this frog starts to go, I guess, around everyone. Gets next to Kathana, sees the snake, and just freezes. Turns like, to stone. No, <laughs> no movement. <laughs> Rot row. Are snakes oh, and frogs God. actually? I guess snakes do actually eat frogs usually. What I'm what I might do is when Max has had his go, we'll go and break. Just because of ads. I'm pretty sure there's a snake eating frog. No, there's lots. If you mean in real life, yes, that is a thing. Well, frogs eating snakes. Not the other way around. Oh. You said Okay, never mind. A snake eating frog, yeah. Yes, okay. Bad English, maybe. Anyway. So, there are photos of spiders here killing snakes. Which is kind of interesting. Impressive. <clears throat> but we are going to have to take that ad break before Max has his turn in that case. Yep. Um, so, quick little bit of um, self-care, housekeeping -y stuff. Please take this opportunity to take your meds if it's time for meds. Check your blood sugar if you need to check your blood sugar. Um, and grab yourself a fresh drink, have something to eat, and do some self-care. Maybe have a bit of a stretch. We will be back just after this ad break. It is scheduled ads. We go off screen when ads run so that you don't miss anything, whether or not you have a subscription. Um, so please sit back. We'll be back really soon. And thank you very much for supporting the stream. Go for it, bye. What's happening? 
Okay. I don't um, know whose turn it is. It's, I think Max is turn. Ah, oh, right. Um, and so Maximilius is going to um, use um, what? There we go. Sorry. Um, vicious Mockery. Hmm. And the snake is going to Okay, um, so he he just basically points a finger and he's just like, um, get out of my sewers, get out of my sewers, you bad snake, I don't like you, get out of my sewers. And um, it takes uh, four points of damage. Oh, nice. That is not the right way. There we go. Cool. I saw your rolls that time as well. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it was just a normal d20. <clears throat> it's Terrace's turn. <clears throat> <clears throat> you know what? She's gonna do exactly what she's done with all the other freaking snakes. We just, we're just gonna, she's just gonna barrel in and attack it. Like, no hose wild, no questions, just straight up, baby. Let's go right here and pounce with claws first, and then bite while holding it. <clears throat> so, does 24 hit? Uh, it, it does. That's 12 slashing damage from my claws. Oof. And then I'm going to bite it with a 25 to hit. And 10 piercing damage. So basically, Terrace just... Paws down on top of the snake, claws out, and then reaches down to bite what she's holding. Yeah. And like uh, rakes so you it. Just just basically like rakes and then bites. Um <laughs> and that is twenty-two points of damage. Um the snake does not look happy, but um it is still uh pretty solid. So tough snake. Sorry, there you go. Alrighty, I am going to get as far as I can to the other side. I can't get to the other side. Oh, yeah, I can get there. So I'm going to try and get into a flanking position here, because that's all of my movement. I'm so close to a why did the elephant cross the sewer? <laughs> <laughs> um, and then... We will do an unarmed strike. Ooh, that's a that's a nice. natural twenty. Nice. Go um, for it. Damn. And so we will <clears throat> throw hands and deal bullying <laughs> uh, seven damage total. Really is bullying. <laughs> this poor snake was sitting all on its own, <laughs> minding its own business. Doesn't matter. It needs to die. Um, and then <laughs> I will follow up with um, Flurry of Blows, which is two additional attacks. So... Oh, that first one's not great. Does a 12 hit? Yes. It does? Okay. I mm -hmm. want to extract aspects with this, which is one of the abilities that I can use with Flurry of Blows. Um... So as I hit it, I can learn all of its damage resistances or vulnerabilities, okay. immunities, or condition immunities. Does it have any? Um, it's a snake. Um, <laughs> it, it, it it doesn't have any uh, resistances so or anything. Yeah, okay, it's, it's, cool. it's, good it's a no know. rope. <clears throat> One of its, it's vulnerabilities no is bears. It's, um. <laughs> it's vulnerable to bears. <laughs> cool. So we'll do another seven damage. And then okay. one last strike. 
which is a 19 to hit, which hits, so we'll do uh, further 6 damage. Oof. Might not hit hard, but you certainly hit a lot. <laughs> I try. Um, th this snake, after all of this, is looking rough. Um, it's basically... Uh, you know when you find a, a piece of uh, snake skin, like uh, like shedding, um, it's it's that, but it's still alive. So, um, oh, oh, just oh, hanging oh, off of it and stuff. Oh, oh no! Oh man, this poor and snake. I feel bad for this snake. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> well, Redeemer, it's your turn. Oh, um, I don't think I can get in range to do anything. Um, because there's a bear here, so I I can go here. You can go uh, through the bear because you're friends. Yeah, you can move through yeah, an ally space. Go, I can't move through the wall. Um, no, but you no, can but move through that, my space, which is movement. in like just here. Yeah, I I haven't been to my space in a while. <laughs> it... For goodness sake! Uh, <laughs> I mean, with the downfall right. of Twitter, you know, it's not a bad this place is, to go. This is twenty feet. Um, so... 25, 30. You could, you could scooch into that spot next to its head. What, like here? Yeah, this, yep. this uh, is just a yeah. little corner, and then... Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, well, there we are then. Uh, I get there, and uh, seeing the snake is not looking so great, I'm just going to try and put out its misery, aim for the neck. Uh, the neck? Yeah. Is the snake it, a it, giant neck? Uh, it, a good it looks at you. I mean, it's like, a snake. This it's like, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> yeah, I'm an emotional robot. I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> oh, I miss anyway. Apparently, there was some part of me inside that was like, no, ghost, I can't do ghost this. in the shell. Yeah, emotional just, damage. And I, I go to swing and and I just. There's, there's no like, momentum or power like holds behind back, it. Like, all of the force, it just, like, touches the snake. <laughs> <laughs> I knight you, sir snake. <laughs> <laughs> now the snake is powered up. Uh, and I'm not going to do any um, bonus action either, uh, so I'll just end my turn. Okay. That was um... impressive. I'm going to start by going over here, except just, now I don't know. I just, I just realized, Ice, did you roll advantage for those rolls? I no. rolled double damage for his uh, hit. Uh, for the natural for 20, his, yeah, uh, I, I technically no, should have rolled twice. He should have had advantage because he, he moved into a flank and then forgot to roll advantage. I mean, he rolled a 20. I don't think he's going to get any better than that. But I, I digress. Am I rolling, or is Redeemer rolling again? No, no, no. It was my turn, not not. Oh, Redeemer's. got it. Okay. So here's. Oh wait, should I have had advantage? Um. That's up to Pi. Yeah, go for it. No, it's fine. Actually, just carry on. Carry on. I think it, you it hate worked the out snake. better. You, you, it worked you better. You the snake better. in high school. You guys didn't get along. <laughs> <laughs> you have a vendetta about the snake. No, I mean the snake you were bros. You should roll again. You should no, roll no, again. No, no, no. Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. <laughs> carry on. Carry on. <laughs> so here's the question. It looks like I can come over here. Because it's 25 feet away and I would only be going through. Me. Oh, no, but I'm going this way. No, no, no. Right. It's just the VTT blocking you if it's saying you can't do it. Yeah, it's like, telling me there's walls in the way. So you just, just need to do it move in two it in two steps. bits. Yeah, okay. like I had to. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to come up here, and then I'm going to come here. Okay. You're got, you got to hug the snake. I am. Down. It's true, yeah. Just like, come snuggle, buddy. Oh, um, <laughs> well, 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 you got to take it on a date first. <laughs> it's true. We did learn. We asked permission before touching. Yes. Yes. Um, so I'm looking at this snake and it looks ill, so I'm not going to bother with the sanctuary shit. Um, that's fitting for where you're looking at. I was, I was going to say, we're, we're covered in shit. I don't think we need any more. Yes, exactly. I'm not 
Just want to point um, that. <laughs> Still a shiny robot. Okay, inflict wounds is first level. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, you yep. are. That's that's a that's a lot of damage. That, that that's is a just lot the of first damage. level spell. <laughs> um, <laughs> the <clears throat> the name of the spell is uh, misleading because you inflicted death. <laughs> 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 There we go. Done. <laughs> Somebody quote that. <laughs> so that, is, and, that uh, is the end of combat, then? That is the end of combat. That was fun. I will change back to non-combat music. Oh. I thought you were going to say your turn. I'm going to turn back to not a bear, and I was like, that doesn't mean there aren't more snakes. Come on. No, I'm not going to chop being a bear. Why would... Uh, if you could be a bear, why would you not be a bear? So you don't have to pick up keys from the sewer floor with your mouth. We have example not I 30 minutes. I do not like this logic. <laughs> I'm just saying. Say two, it's two distasteful. Frogs show up as, as, as the snake dies, two frogs show up and just start, like, eating all of it. Where did they come from? Uh, did we see well, they 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 share part of the snake like uh, Lady in the Tram. Lady in the Tram. Oh my god! Oh, yes. No. <laughs> like that, so. god. Oh man. Yes. We're gonna need we're gonna need fan art of that, unfortunately. Mm. And uh, maybe some therapy. Um, yes. You know? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now now I just picture Way in his next therapy session. He's like, and and they were like Lady in the Tram. No, but they were frogs. <laughs> and it sticks. <laughs> you know noodle, what? Yeah. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let's talk about my childhood. <laughs> um, Fantastic. I'm going to look all around the floor behind me, left, right, in every direction. What do I see? Yeah. Darkness. Right. <laughs> like oh, nothing. So much yeah, darkness. No initiative. Oh, darkness, oh, my oh, old God. friend. Should have, should have seen Wait. that coming. Um. Oh, sorry. Don't roll initiative yet. That's my. Oh. Apologies. Don't oh, roll initiative. I forgot. I forgot to end combat. We've got to clear yeah. the previous one. Okay. Just let my token go. Pokeball. Three. Are you kidding? <laughs> now roll I'll... initiative. Really? Yeah. I'll... I'll give you the uh, the eleven on that. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> like, I, something something's up with Redeemer today. They just they're not quite they're not quite there. They got they right. feel bad usually, for these snakes. <laughs> usually we're at the top of the initiative order. And we're rolling middle middle to low ro uh, road at the moment. It is yeah, but at least you're hitting. Well, Redeemer's not actually. Oh, no, Redeemer's not doing bad. anything. <laughs> Redeemer's just looking. Like Redeemer's got really good vision today, but other than that, <laughs> to like... be fair, to be fair, Redeemer is probably sitting there going, "Why am I even here? The bear is just taking over." <laughs> I feel like more frogs should be helping us at every stage because we are providing food. Well, we do have uh, two frogs with us. Three frogs, if you include Maximilius. Well, they're not on the list yet. Okay. There we go. Uh, they're still the lady and tramping still, right? You're right. You're right. That's gonna take some time. I mean, it was a big snake. It, took it was up fifteen nine feet squares. of snake. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fifteen feet square of snake. Okay. Um. So, the snakes mm. see you all approach. Um. And so the first snake is going to go after Kitana. Oh, get the little one with a bite. Thanks, buddy. Um, can can you roll a, a Constitution saving through for me? Yes. Oh no. Fun fact. Uh, many years ago, 
playing, I think, 3.5, maybe 3rd edition. Um, actually, no, it was 3rd edition. Uh, I lost my favourite rogue to a failed fortitude, no, a failed constitution saving throw in the sewers from poison. Oh, oh no. Like, or from, from venom from a creature okay. that bit us. Uh, Kithana takes 11 points of damage. Oof. Okay. Oh no. This so this is this is something you'll be talking about in your next therapy session then. <laughs> Repeated trauma for <laughs> snake poisoning in, right. in sewers. Like <laughs> this <is> red. <laughs> um I was sitting here going, I'm resistant to poison though. I'm not, that's my other character. <laughs> I'm resistant to magical sleep, not poison. Um this frog uh, goes and tries to fight the snake. Yes. And I can't give anyone hit dice until it's my turn. <laughs> Sit here uselessly. Oof, and it it does not hit. Oh no! It it shows up and basically gets stage fright and just kind of. <laughs> Maybe it saw the big one and then froze like previously. And so the uh, oh the big ones <laughs> moving to Far the snake. Out, that looks or intimidating to, when it moves the across the screen. It really did, didn't it? Like uh, <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> Since it moved, I was like, oh dear. <laughs> come alive I don't like when the bad guys get to go before us <laughs> this isn't fun <laughs> this is how we die it, it, it bites the frog and uh, the frog is not looking too great so oh no and now it is Terrace's turn sorry back 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 there we go good to go Oh, can the bear get past? That's a great question. <laughs> oh, I think you muted, Red. Oh, oh yeah, um, you definitely actually, are. Actually, she, she dropped Wild Shape last turn um, after combat. So, hold on a sec while I correct this. No, she didn't. She didn't drop Red, wild shape. She dropped muted. the combat music. I had misunderstood. Oh, 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 okay. Sorry, that's that's misunderstanding. But also, Red, you are muted. Yeah, Red, you're muted. I think all of us have said it so far, and you only just clicked. That was amusing. Can we get a clip <laughs> of that, please? Yeah, yeah. We could. just like the whole sequence. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Can you talk? Are you still muted? I'm not still. I hope I'm not still okay. muted. <laughs> no, you're no. fine now. <laughs> Mentally <laughs> muted. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh. So. Okay. 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 Shit. Um. I am large, and I don't know if I'm going to fit somewhere. <laughs> large I can't, and not very in charge. Like, if if that is that snake alive or dead? It's alive still. Yep, both, both of alive. them are alive. Yeah. I don't think I've got reach. Alive and ready to thrive. Neither has taken an ounce of... So I can't move through their squares because they are not allies. Yep. Although they are. No, I can't pass through that one to stand on the other side of it. It's completely blocked. I can't do anything. You can come stand Nothing. where I am. Well, she, you can, she can't stop on you. I can't she stop can in move. your square. I can pass through it. Yeah. Mm. I take four squares. Can I pick you up and throw you? That's can I nice. use a dodge action? <laughs> With that, like, can I dodge out of the way of the incoming bear? Is that a thing? Um, Actually, I can I the, uh... nuzzle her out of the way gently? Uh, you could push her out of the way, but I think that would be your action. I'm not opposed. 
But again, that would be your action, so... Mm. It's not worth it for an action. Um, alright. I am going to move to here. Just the closest I can get, and I'm just going to bellow really loudly in frustration in the hope that somebody figures out that they need to leave enough space for me um, <laughs> on their next Listen. turn. <laughs> Listen, I the would. doesn't revolve around Terrors. Yes, it does. <laughs> No, it doesn't. It doesn't <laughs> and I hold action to see if anything Paris. comes into like anything comes into range. Yeah. Okay. So Paris is just going to be frustrated. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> the poor frog is shocked. Oh, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> It got bit, turned around, looked at the snake, all of a sudden behind it comes this big bellow from a bear. <laughs> like, how the hell did a bear get in the sewers? Yeah, I'm having a bit of a shitty time at the moment. Uh, but yeah, that's that's the end of my go. Hashtag pun. <clears throat> so now it is Maximilius' turn. And he's going to move up here. Mm, block the way more. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Not for most of us. Only for only for bears. <laughs> only for the bear. Mm. <laughs> and he's going to cast um, Bardic Inspiration. <laughs> What does that mean? Uh, you you basically gain an inspiration die. Um, so did you cast it? On? I'm never gonna. On me, I'm never gonna remember to do it. Oh uh, yeah, there's a spot on your character sheet that you can post it so that you remember it's there. Yeah, my other character has had one there for I shit you not four years. Oh, <laughs> oh right, wow. you 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 add it after you you make a roll. Um, oh, I know. So... <laughs> Yeah. I'm gonna remember anything. <laughs> okay, look, sure. Look, look, he's just trying to help. So. I appreciate <laughs> the effort. <Everest. laughs> it's not a case on involvement. It's a Tazzy problem. <laughs> so what we need to do is when when Tazzy gets something like that, we all need a post-it note put in our monitors. Remind Tazzy next time. Next time around. <laughs> I wonder if Sari has uh, Sari Bar has like a, a notepad feature, so you can just <laughs> put it in there. Only I mean, helps I can people code looking at chat. Even with that, but... You're not supposed he... to be looking at chat. He... Right, exactly. He goes, he goes to stab stab the oh, snake sure. with his rapier and basically like misses completely just around the snake. So accidentally catches Kathana. No, <laughs> I'm already hurt. Inspiration on yeah. a stick. <laughs> and this, this frog just kind of goes up to the corner to kind of hide a little bit. Um, Aww. Thanks, buddy. Skate the snake. Skate the snake. Okay, so. Uh, I am going to take this opportunity to cast Twilight Sanctuary. Um, just to make sure before I do this, I'm not going to accidentally grant extra hit points to enemy combatants, correct? No, it's just allies. It only happens to allies. Okay, good. So, anyone who is within a 30 foot radius of me which i think is all of you it's everyone yeah okay i can't count that high but yeah everybody um now at the end of your turn whenever you end your turn in this sphere you get 1d6 plus 3 of temporary hit points oh mm -hmm. so it's not what, now stacking? it's next turn and it stacks Yes. Now, here's the question. Wow. Now that I've 
done this. It is my action. Does it? Can I do it for me now, since I am ending my turn within my own sphere? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. Now, the. Did that work? Well, it rolled something. Roll the d6, right? Oh, up there, it's five. Two. One d6 plus your cleric level. Oh, yeah. And. It says five. It says one d6 plus three. If you scroll up, it shows five. So I get five temporary hit points. Yep. Fabulous. Now, do I have to roll for everybody each turn, or can they do it? Um, as I. I would say you you roll it at the end of their turn um, cool. if they're in the circle, just so it applies the bonus. Cool. All right, um, and that's all I can do, correct? Um, you you could still action. move, or <clears throat> any bonus actions. Bonus <clears throat> actions, bonus actions, bonus actions. As a reminder, <clears throat> you could move. Healing. You. I I what behind me? An angry bear behind you that's frustrated oh, yes. that it can't get anywhere. You, you could move yes, diagonally I wasn't sure if I'm allowed forwards, to also move. which would not attract an attack of opportunity, but would make space for me to get in. If I go, whoops, here, it doesn't, it's not going to fight me? No, because you don't leave its range. Mmm, okay. Cool. Um... Here's a question. It says that healing word is a bonus action. Does it use up a spell slot? Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm, fuck that. Okay. Next. <laughs> um, can I, I pass through two people like this? You can. You should be fine. Oh, okay. Cool. We're friends. Otherwise, you can pass through their space. Um, Redeemer's just going to sling the sword on their shoulder just casually and just casually step almost over these two because they're, they're not that tall but they're not tiny either but just kind of almost standing on them <laughs> uh just push by and uh go for the 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 big boy um and hmm, what do i want to do here what do i want to do here i should have thought about this while i was sitting there doing nothing um <clears throat> I'm going to. I'm just gonna sh- try and strike it first with my great sword. Okay. Which is a twenty-one. Yep, that hits. Um, I'm gonna roll for damage, which was mediocre. Um, with that, I'm going to. Um. You know, use the the smite. Um, that I have. Where is it? It's Divine Smite, isn't it? So, oh, the, it's covering up all my stuff. Um, you can expend one spell slot to deal 2d8. Um, which does an extra 8 radiant damage. Um, and that that's not... That's just part of my action, isn't it? So, that's one spell slot gone. Um, so, I guess that was a total of, what, 22 damage from that? And then, as a bonus action, <laughs> what's that? Did I do oh, something it's wrong? just a casual twenty-two damage, and then. <laughs> oh right, sorry. Um, and then, as a bonus action, actually, I don't know if I could do this. I want to cast thunderous smite, so, but I think maybe I should have cast it before. So this is no good, actually. Yeah, forget it. Don't worry about it. It's all good. I should have cast it before because it it's uh, concentration. I completely forgot about that. Um, How long do temporary hit points last? Um, until, until the spell ends, right? rest or they're used. Okay. Oh, right. Is it? Is it that long? Oh. Normally. Okay. Um, yeah, actually, that's just going to be my turn then. Depending okay. on how Let me... they're done. Let me give you some extra hit points, Redeemer. Oh, nice. An extra five hit points. No, an extra eight. Oh, yeah, sorry. I saw the dice roll. Yeah. Nice. So just eight temporary hit points. Rock out. Oh, you go. I'm on 39 health. Not bad. Beefy boy. All right. 
Uh, Quinn is going to take a interesting route to get around these snakes and will take an attack of opportunity because he's going to effectively run in an L shape to get to here. So if you can just imagine, he would have run past the smaller of the two snakes. So I guess I take an attack of opportunity because I'm leaving the space. Mm -hmm. The wee snake. Uh, so. oh. Oof. Yeah. Was that meant that to be is. the little one? It's the big one. Well, I haven't no, left. No, he hasn't place. left its I, range. I oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I actually forgot about the little one. Well, I didn't. Plus four, plus two. Wow. That does, uh, not, hit. That does not hit. Thank God yep. for that. All right. Um, and then I am going to make some unarmed strikes because damage. Do it. These are going to be with advantage because I am to... Oh, come on. That's rude. Does Oof. a 10 hit? It does not hit. Uh, yikes. Unlucky. Yeah, I'll spend a key point and use Flurry of Blows because that just sucks. Uh... So a 22 should hit mm -hmm. or six damage and then come on. All right. Oof. There's so many hits. ones and 20s tonight. Yeah, I know. I'm glad I'm rolling with advantage because that wouldn't have not been nice. If they weren't um, digital, I think these dice were loaded in some way. Yeah. <laughs> And that's uh oh, mm. one on the damage side. That's four hit uh, four points of damage. Mm -hmm. Uh, and that will end my turn. Not before. Oh, yes. You take temporary hit points. It's not. It didn't go this time. I'm gonna click again and see what happens. It might have been because I ended my turn. Or because I've already done it twice. No, yeah, but that doesn't make your, sense. Your limit, right? No, no, it, it's, it it's, shouldn't. It's not a, I was going to say, I, I think with it, you might be sharing the actual spell and not the um, yeah. action button. I think you only need to click on the the 1d6 bit. 1d6. Or 1. Yeah. yeah. The B. There you go. There we go. Uh, okay. Interestingly, but that plus hasn't three, added the, though. the plus three, yeah. whereas it was before. It did the other time. I clicked on the same thing yeah. I did last time. But anyway, That's five points good. for you, sir. Awesome. Thank you very much. Enjoy them. Use them in good health. I hope to. Um, or rather, use them so for this... good health. Hmm. All right, this, uh, this poisonous snake is going to go for Katana. Valid. What well, it did last time. Not much creativity in this genre. No! <laughs> this is a show about natural 20s and natural 1s. It really is. Red, I'm making you roll up my next character. <laughs> okay. um, That's rough. That is... That's 12. Total? Yep. Okay, so first of all, that's my temporary and my current. Shouldn't that no. have been eight total? Yeah. Because it's two on the dice, doubled plus four. You only double the dice, not the bonus. Oops. This isn't the first time 
been down to zero hit points. Well, I think it happened last week also. Mm -hmm. So hang on, did you take eight or did you take 12, Tazzy? I've done nothing yet because you both said wait and now I'm waiting. Um, I I just doubled the the, the damage. Um, you you the damage in fifth edition you double the dice and then add the bonus. So the bonus only gets added once. So okay, if so, you're so it'd be two d four plus four. Yeah. You can either roll the dice twice or just double what you get on the dice. A lot of people just double what they get on the dice, so you don't mm -hmm. have to. There we go. Oh yeah. Nine. Nine. Okay. All right. Where Still you upright. Three. Oh no. It's more wow. than zero. No, wait. I'm not a cleric. It's fine. I'm not the cleric. No, I'm the cleric. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not fine because it is our cleric. We don't have healing otherwise. Yes, we do. <laughs> I'm trying to give you guys extra hit dice on every every turn you have, but if I'm dead, I can't. Oh, wait. Do you need to do a concentration check now? Um, is that spell a concentration? Is that spell a concentration Because I, I asked God nicely. It's channel divinity. Yeah, right. it's not. Um, okay. It's not a concentration. Okay. It says until you are incapacitated or die. So I assume incapacitated means zero. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, and so so this this frog tried to uh, bite the snake and missed again. So. Oh damn it! it is now. Well, thank you for trying, buddy. Big big snake, um, and it's gonna go for Quinn. Oh. Well, at least it's not me. He tried to punch it in the butt, so... I did. <laughs> butt puncher. That's true. <laughs> mm. That is 19 to hit. Oh, yeah, that hits. 12 piercing damage. Ow! Can I give a bear temporary hit points? Yep. Yep. Okay, I'm a living creature. <laughs> okay. And now it's Terrence's turn. Legit, if you can give it to Redeemer, you can give it to a bear. Like, I'm your ally. It's fine. That's true. At least you think I am. This just makes me think of, if you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. <laughs> Alright. On a step forward. Whoa. Yes? My computer just decided to minimize everything for a second. Um, really sorry, that. everybody. Rude. Um, all right, I'm gonna move one step forwards. <laughs> Stomp on this fucking snake. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Ethan appreciates this. In favor I, of all snake stomping, but especially I, this one. I definitely need a counter for red ruins the VTT. Ah, oh, I just press bite instead. Hang on. I'm I'm not biting it. I'm clawing it. Um, does 20 hit? <laughs> yes. That is 12 points of slashing damage. Okay. Is it still Wait, up? Which... Oh, sorry. You I can only hit one of them. Everyone else is in my freaking way. Yeah. Yeah. If the well, frog had moved. Technically, technically I'm we're not very in your weak. Way. You're just a very giant bear. I'm very weak. I'm leaning against the wall. <laughs> Um, you, you did kill the snake with your Brilliant. Friends. Thank fuck. And I am gonna bellow again. It's my bonus action. Because... Oh, you're you're gonna make that frog have The frog is in the way. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's Poor that frog, frog did not nothing. Move. You have... Nope. You're just scaring the poor boy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's the point. I want him to move out of the way. Get out of the, the way, one, Froggy! You scared, scared the other him one. stiff. Okay, I am going to give you... Oh, there you go. I did the three. I don't understand this Wait, thing at all. Wait, it twice? Well, the first one's better anyway. So. Yeah, that's that's really not working. And or is the it? first one added the three and the second yeah. one didn't. I don't Oh, understand. no, the second one's better. The second one's better. If you don't, if you add the same, I don't care. Take one of them. I don't... I'm taking the one that was rolled first because that's fair. <laughs> uh, so I get five temporary hit points. 
Sweet. That All is me. Okay. Um, so now it's 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 Maximilius' turn, and he he can see that that Kithon is not doing so hard. So he's going to uh, cast Healing Word. Thank you. Oh. What a good little froggy. A lovely little bard. Hey. Okay, and that's six healing. And then. Oh, okay. He's going to do, uh, sorry, he's going to move and then uh, do six damage to the snake. Hi, can you talk up a bit? Oh, nice sorry. poke. Can you hear me? Yeah. Good. Okay. Sorry. Uh, I was mumbling. <laughs> and that is Maximilius's turn. No, it's not. Maximilius can have... Whoa. Why does Max get all the health? Max gets nine. Because nine. Cause the frogs haven't gotten any. <laughs> oh, that's right. Yeah, the frogs are within the 30 foot radius. Maybe they should have had some. It's a good point. I didn't really think about that. That was speciesist wow. of me. Very much so. <laughs> okay. Um. And so, well, there you uh, go. Give the frog the one. There you go. The frog go ahead, frog. Go. Have a one. <laughs> one plus three. Spring it is four. Man. It is four. And that that frog is uh, basically ate the snake and tried moving away. And uh, this oh no! Big snake is going to. Oh no! Uh oh, oh. Rot, rot, raggy. Rot, oh raggy. Mm -hmm. Who, who is it attacking? The frog that left the, its a, its rage. Oh no. And that frog is dead. Feel a little bit guilty. Oh no! Even with the 4 HP? Oh no. Wait, Wait that what one happened? didn't have any extra health. That one didn't have the any frog extra health. Died. The snake ate the frog. The frog and ate that the was... snake, and the snake ate the frog. Yeah. Definitely yes. some kind of snake exception going on there. Oh no. The old lady has swallowed a fly. I don't know why. And now it is Kithon's turn. Oh. Okay. Um. <laughs> so, it, because its square is next to me, even though, like, shape-wise, it isn't, that bottom left square is doesn't actually have snake in it, but does it count as having snake in it? Do you know what you I mean? Yeah. Diagonally? Uh, it, it counts as it, snake. It, 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 yeah, I was going to say, it takes up that entire square, so... Okay. It does, but it also doesn't. Um, I am going to inflict more wounds in hopes of inflicting more death. I'm sorry, but that was such a neurodivergent, like, thing to pick on. It's like, I know it's the square, but it's not in that square. <laughs> does a 14 hit? It does. Okay, it takes 16 necrotic damage. Woof! Okay. Um, this snake is looking rough. So. No longer smooth. Okay. Um, I That's am going right. to... Where was... Toilet? Is that the bit we click on? Okay, well, five hit points for me. And... Go ahead, Redeemer. Just standard attack. Again. 16. Yep. Do you need to do your thunderous smite? No, I won't, I won't bother at the moment. Um, trying to limit. I won't even, um, I won't even add bless to this either. I won't even add a divine smite to it. So 
It's just a very mediocre 8 damage. Yeah, totally mediocre. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Fucking paladins, man. God. <laughs> <laughs> the most punchy member of our party. It's like, oh, sorry, guys. Only 8. Only 8 today. We're, mm. we're level 2. <laughs> I think I rolled I mean, a he's one more the smitey one, one. The punchy one is... is... The, uh, the, the level, we are level the elephant three. Elephant does the punching. Yeah, I was gonna say you level three. <laughs> um, but yeah, there you go. That's uh, end of my turn. Alrighty, I am going to look around this snake a little bit just to make sure I continue with the uh, flanking. And we I will... briefly imagined you picking up the snake and whipping it around. Whipping it. Yeah. I'm glad that that's not... I whip the snake back and forth. Oh. <laughs> Admittedly, anyway, are, are we all supposed going. to have been rolling advantage? Are we all flanking? I don't know how this quite works. Well, we've is all hit Is it because hit someone anyway. else is flanking? Or, or it's just out of curiosity. Technically, you're supposed to be... Directly opposite. Directly opposed to one of your allies. Right. Um... Which is why I've moved, just to make sure that everyone on that side should technically have advantage yeah advantage okay um well we thank you for the thing we didn't remember we had much obliged sir that's okay so as he you you still have a bardic inspiration so you <laughs> no, no exactly uh, also did, were you supposed to give me extra hit points <laughs> am i allowed to be inspired oh i didn't realize you finished did i oh no i gave myself i didn't give you i'm sorry mm. um Oh, nice. And they stack, eight? right? So Yeah. Yeah, they yeah so now you have another eight on top of whatever you had. Just like... like uh, half my HP again. Yes, keep rolling on the... the... Can I use a Bardic Inspiration in trying to hit? I'm... You can. Yes. Interesting, okay. You use it for any dice roll, right? Um, so you, you, you hit the snake and it just basically goes into the water... And doesn't come back up. Are we calling that water? Brown water. I mean, I'm I'm just <laughs> amused because like there's been a bear that's been trying to get at this giant snake for so long, and it's just there in the water, not moving anymore. <laughs> <laughs> um. So Quinn, your turn's over. My turn is over. Yes. Um, Go ahead and take yourself Ooh, nine. nine temporary hit points. I love it. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. That is the end of combat. Um, so logistically, what? since just combat gonna... is over, but the minute isn't over. Well, is the minute over is my question. It was ten rounds. I think we were on round seven uh, after that, so... Oh wow! Wait, is was it, it really no? Is it a round? No, no, it was it was like five. Let's see. Sorry. Whoa, that was round. Yeah, two but Tazzy didn't combat. do it in the first. Yeah. Is so? Is it each individual person? Is it ten turns or ten rounds? Yeah, because ten, ten... ten rounds of everyone. Yeah. Well, so... I certainly didn't hit that button that many times. No, more I than ten it, times. It was only two yeah. rounds because Terrace only got it once. Yeah, yeah, I was thinking the entire encounter. Um, but yeah. So the question that's is... An, that's an interesting rule to sort of have to rule on. So does it only apply whilst we're in combat? Or could Tazzy technically... Could we all technically it, apply some temporary hit points for the next minute? I was going to say, it Can technically I just, like, keep says clicking? At, at the end of your turn. Mm, yeah. Which right. would constitute battle but at the same time i i get it like it's cast you still have 30 seconds why wouldn't you so terrace um... hit me <laughs> so wait you, how many times have you got to roll it for everyone <laughs> i pick up the snake and i hit him with it no. <laughs> god no so like should i just roll it another three times and everybody just takes um, whatever what are the that rules is for improvised weapon in fifth edition <laughs> I'm going to say no, we're I off think, track. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we can apply additional hit points here because it's it, it's at the end of everyone's turn and we don't have any more turns because combat's over. 
Okay. I think that would be an abuse of the. Uh... Mm. Be better Plus, than we'd all be rest. walking around with oh, like. God. Yeah, I was gonna say we'd all be walking around with like an extra fifty HP. Just. Listen. It's a good way to keep everyone up, but it's not. You may as well cast that after every rest. <laughs> just, just like full party of uh, Twilight Domain clerics, and they just cast it each battle. One of oh. them. Legit. One day I want to play an all cleric party. It's like it's a goal. I want to play an all cleric party. Like a crusade of clerics for their god doing whatever their god demanded. Or whatever. I actually wanted to each one have their own god and it's just it's a competition constantly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like but yeah, one. every every single cleric in the party has to be a different domain. Um and oh, it's no. it's it's a thing that I've been wanting to do. So no no cler no two clerics are the same. Um and yeah. I mean it would be an absolute bitch for the DM to balance, that's the problem. So, <laughs> given how balanced clerics are, yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, I could just imagine, like, the, the, let's say you got four clerics just walking down the street together, and they come across this poor, this this person just off to the side, and they're like, "Do you need help?" They go over to help, and then they're like, "Ah." Oh, my god provided you with the assistance and then the next one comes on and goes my god give you the assistance and the poor guy's like oh i don't know who to believe so there's a there's a, a webtoon called um order of the stick and it's been around forever um and they had this episode where the main cleric for the party goes off and meets another cleric and the two of them go off to do something and they come across this dragon this dragon starts attacking them and attacking them and attacking them and Every time, like every time they get hit, they heal. And it's just like, right. heal, heal, heal. And this dragon turns around and goes, fuck this, I'm getting tired, and leaves. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so. That's fantastic. Um, <clears throat> right, before we continue, um, uh, as combat is over, uh, Redeem is just going to turn to uh, Kaythana, who I believe is still looking a little bit worse for wear. Um, just put a hand on your shoulder and and give you five hit points. Um, which isn't a Thank huge you. amount, but, uh, you know, hopefully it'll help out a little bit. Much obliged. Just, oh, oh, no. Bit. I hit the wrong button. I damaged myself. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I didn't cast Inflict Wounds. I don't have that ability, okay? <laughs> it's okay, I fixed it. Redeemer Forget. places his hand on Kithana as he makes the 56k dial-up modem noise. <laughs> <laughs> That would be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, with my temporaries, I'm doing just fine now. Okay. Um, I am, um, in fact, feeling a little peppy. We do, however, have an ad break. So, okay. kind go. of perfectly timed, combat's done. Um, so, take this opportunity, everybody, to have a bit of a self-care break for yourselves while we also do. Um, we go off-camera while the ads are playing on Twitch. So, please grab yourself a fresh drink. Take your meds if it's time for meds. Check your blood pressure. If, blood pressure? Blood sugar. If you need to check your blood sugar, make sure you are looking after yourself. And we'll be back just after this.
Okay. Um, so we're back, and you guys just finished off this uh, giant constrictor snake. Um, there's a locked gate uh, to the right, or yeah, and then um, to the north are just two two ways that you haven't, um, I guess, ventured yet. So. I would like to look around and see if I find a key that matches a symbol on the door Same. to the right. Does it have a symbol on the door? It does. <laughs> Didn't occur to me to ask. No, okay. Because in the past you described the doors as having something. Does it match any of the <laughs> keys Tazzy's already holding? Good it question. Uh, roll perception. Um, who's rolling perception? I did. Several. Nice. So many. Nice too. Okay. Um, so you you notice it's a it's a ram's head um on on the gate. Um and it does not match either of the trinkets that you have. No, I was looking around for a key. Oh oh, oh sorry. Um Redeemer was looking at what it was. <laughs> gotcha. <clears throat> well, oh yeah, that answers both of those. It. I'll be I didn't. To it. <laughs> I didn't actually hear what you said, Ty. Oh, um, there is no key. Uh, you don't. You don't see any trinkets or anything. Okay. Um, <clears throat> if we can't progress this way, I'd look up. Left, follow. Up. right, left yeah, up or right say, up. I'll, one of the two. I'll look down the pathway that I'm closest to. I'm looking this way. Okay. I'm waiting. Waking down, waking down. Sorry. <laughs> I don't, I don't see much apparently. Okay. Um. It it just looks like a dark, dark entryway into, um, I guess some some small alcoves. Oof. Whoa. <clears throat> Who rolled the, the one? Was it a one? Someone rolled. That a sound one. is a one, but it doesn't show it. Yeah. I don't... I don't know who rolled that. Who's um who's what's... It looked like my die, but my my thing said says fourteen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was strange. Um, um So did you say there was an alcove here up ahead? Yep, yeah. There's uh two two ways left and right. Um but it's dark, so you'd have to get closer. Yeah, I'll start walking up. I'm giving um, them dark vision if it helps. I am also walking upwards. Okay. Um, roll roll roll. Initiative. Say um, I'm waiting. Do I have to roll initiative? Me. Oh, um, every time. Oh, no encounters be great. Sorry. <laughs> I mean, you're you're not in line of sight, so um, I'll let you catch up. But um, everyone else, roll initiative. And give me one second so I can... Yeah, this. sorry. Sorry. I jumped the gun a bit. Good. That's my bad. Sorry, who's the person who's not rolling initiative? Uh, Terrace. Just Barris. Got it. Okay. Is is Terrace going further up? Okay. Um, Terrace, roll initiative. Oh, oh, oh. Time. Nicely done, Queen. Whoa, that's hell of a Bravo. Roll. Oh, I mean, it's better than what I originally rolled by two. Oh, I don't like the look of this list. Okay, it's getting shorter. <laughs> oh, oof. oh, oh, everybody Thank left. For control Z. Yeah. What um, just happened? Now it says not started, and there's only three unknown combatants. Hold on, sorry, it. I had to control Z. I accidentally deleted everything. <laughs> my bad. Whoa, nice roll, Quinn. So many. All right, First, do you want me to reroll? Um, no, I can put whatever you had before. Okay. Just a minute. Uh, 
Um, while you get everything sorted, I'm just going to um, step out for a sec. Like the sound of how many dice that is. Yeah, it's yeah. intimidating, isn't it? I'm it's guessing so many. there's a bunch of extra stuff that I can't see <laughs> around where Barris mm. is. So, <laughs> just um. looking at this list, I'm regretting using my Twilight Sanctuary already. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. We'll be fine. I personally am the kind of person who's always like, I'll save it for later, I'll save it for later, and then I never actually use the thing. Like, mm. in real life, like, mm -hmm. I, candies that I've, like, saved for years, which is stupid, they're garbage now. Um, and I was like, I'm not gonna do that, I'm gonna jump in and use the thing. You know how, like, when you throw away a box of all those old cables, you're like, I'll never yep. need these again, and then you need one, and then you're like, well, I'm certainly never throwing a cable out again for the rest of my life. That's mm -hmm. how I'm feeling I, right now. I already hit the latter stage of that. I've, 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 I just don't throw them. Just don't do it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I have within sight about you wanna 15 be scared, cables. Red? You're gonna be scared. <laughs> Look at the list, the initiative list. Hang on, let me let me show everybody the the initiative list so that everybody gets to to have this moment. Holy kidding? shit! Yeah, well, it's not as bad as it could be. Oh. Yep. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. What were you saying? Yeah, yeah. It's not as bad as it could be. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Mm -hmm. Uh we got we got vampire spawn. Two mm. vampire oh. spawn and still two freaking snakes. So we have a giant poisonous oh, snake, we have a giant constrictor snake, and then we have two vampire spawn. So the poison ones were the large but not enormous, and the constrictor mm. was the 15 square. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fuck off. The constrictor is this big one here in the middle, and then that's a little oh. poisonous one, and I can't see the vampire mm. spawn. No, I, we, I can't see a constrictor either, so... Oh, the the cons the constrictors in front of me. Mm. We can't see fine. you from where we are. I see nothing, right? <laughs> I can't I see can you. See Redeemer, I went around Quinn. the corner. So Maybe the there's two, two different battle areas. Or... Yeah, I think it's essentially two battles here. Well, so nice. uh, what we're saying is we uh, split the party. Split the party. I mean, only one person went off by themselves. So I just... Yeah. Mm. Just, we were looking. Just saying. <laughs> oh. You probably can't see him, but you might see a tail in a moment. There you go. Oh, Hi, exclamation baby. way, cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's settling down. He's settling. He's settling, buddy. I don't, I don't think he'd show on the camera. Just mess up everything here. Yeah. Back to where we were. Oh, not the microphone. No. He's bopping the microphone. Rude. Keep your butt down. <laughs> Keep your butt down. It just Don't raises think we it did up. A like... Split chat. Well, let's do that. No, not that. Well, I mean, that. Hang on. We should we should do that one twice. But that's not what I did. I copied this one. Oh, Troy got the split one. Cool. Thanks, Troy. Yay, Troy. Troy to MVP. Troy's always the MVP. <laughs> Can't believe he's awake. I know, right? Like, it must be... Bad, man. What, like, four in the morning or something? We, we start at, like, 1am for Troy. Amazing. Yikes. Joy, just remember self care. Yeah. Sleep. Don't give me from Coming from Don't give me lecturing. Of all the people here <laughs> to tell Troy to go to sleep, you have no fucking room. 
<laughs> we saw you in Discord all night. Oh, yeah. Every single one of our games, Pi does an all-nighter beforehand. Yeah, I noticed Literally a message. Uh, I think it was like 4 my time. 4 a.m. my time. I was like, okay. Pi's getting started early. <laughs> yeah, I think Pi, Pi jumped into group chat at like 2 a.m. for, for Pi. 1 a.m. <laughs> Time is a weird seat. Oh, all right, no, like an all nighter on is keyboard. one thing, but the fact that you pull an all nighter while having an infant and a toddler is just—it's impressive. Like you've mm. been, you've been tired existentially for the last five years, anyway. That's my secret cab. I'm always tired. <laughs> no, I, actually, I'm, 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 I, I don't know. It's weird. So. I strangely envy your ability to do it, because I actually can't I... pull an all-nighter anymore. I don't. Yeah, I can't do it either. That's it's because we're old. Okay. Well, that, I was, yeah. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> it's, it must be an age thing, because I used to be able to do it all the time. Mm -hmm. The last time I tried to do an all-nighter, I crashed at 9am and couldn't wake up for about four hours, so... Like my longest D&D mm. game without sleeping was like 36 hours. Back in the day, was it? It was amazing. <laughs> All right. Can't do that anymore. Are we starting? Okay. Yep. It's Quinn's turn. Okay. Has the combat tracker begun? It is now. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to, because I'm not seeing much of anything at the moment, I'm going to run forward to see what I can. Uh huh. <laughs> I still hey. can't see anything. You just went into blackness and went off. Oh. Hey, Pi, it's dark up here. Is there a way of giving me the ability to see what I Queen can see? Let me see. Didn't we have to do a screenshot before? Mm. And I don't mind like if it's a screenshot. I can show that. No, last time I think when I went down in the sewers, Pi just like brought. Terrace down in the sewers. There you go. This is black for me. I've got no one now. Oh, weird. I have you selected and it shows. You everything. have dark vision. <laughs> Alright, well, in any case, I'm going to continue and I am going to attack this vampire spawn because I don't like vampires at all. That is a natural 19 for 24 to hit. I really hope that hits, because if it doesn't, I'm in a lot of trouble. <laughs> We're all in a lot of trouble. trouble. <laughs> yeah. Jinx. Uh, and I will do... Uh, uh, six damage. Okay. And then I will not go with a flurry of blows here. I'm just going to do one more unarmed strike. Oh no, that does not that hit. That was almost That's amazing. Done. Yeah, but it wasn't. Um, so that is a miss, I am assuming. Mm -hmm. And that will be the end of my turn. Okay. And now it is... Um, sorry, I was working on Tyrus's vision. Um, it showed me that you could see, but then it didn't work on your end, which is weird. Uh, bear with me just a moment. Well, the goal is a bear with you. I mean, I'm, yep. I'm, no, I've just got everything is grayed. The fog of war thing. That I think the fog of war is black. This is, you. this is a, this is a a grey over, and I can't see any of the bad guys. In Age of Empires 2, there was two types of fog of war. There was the fog of war, which was all the black area, and as soon as you revealed that, you had the revealed section of the map, but because you couldn't see it, it still counted as fog of war. Mm, yeah. Starcraft did the same thing. Yeah. The double layer fog It's alright. Does somebody want to give me a screenshot? Sure, give me a second. I'm gonna have to rearrange things. So I it's gonna, it's gonna be simpler. I think um, Quinn can see a lot more than me as well. So yeah, one do that, moment. Quinn. 
Um, I've switched to the stream so I can see what you can see, <laughs> Paris. Mm. Although yeah, I have to I have actually, big snick. I'm going to have to keep the it's in, uh, game chat. PTT loaded as well. Um, so this giant poisonous snake is going to go for Terrace. And need to bite. I just tried to zoom Ooh, in. Interesting. On the stream. That's a 15 to hit. Uh, I think so. Yeah, my bear armor class is only 11. Okay. Oof. And uh, I mean, it's a bear. Yeah. Also, <laughs> roll a uh, Constitution saving throw. Oh God. Oh, here's a question. Do I roll that as Terrace or the bear? I do it as the bear. Bear should have good constitution, right? Theoretically. I don't have any saving throws on here, so I'm just going to roll a constitution check. Okay, uh, you take 15 damage. Oh. I'm going to have to mark this on my notebook because I'm not using my own hit points. Because why would I? And now it's Keith on turn. I'm going to move. Uh, what was it, 15? Let's... Yeah. Since I'm not, since I'm only going to move, I move once or twice. Why? You can move twice if you're just moving. Can, whoops. See? Okay. No go, though. If you need to move, if you could, as long as you don't move further than your distance, arguably, you can move your characters, characters as many times as you want. You can just only move up to a certain distance. Right. right. Hi, here's the question. Mm -hmm. Should I not be able, like, right after Quinn, there's a hard black line for me, and I don't see anything past Quinn's tile horizontally. Line of sight. It's not nothing to do with dark vision. Yeah, you just haven't been there yet. Like, if, if, if you go around the corner, you'll be able to see. Mm. Have I not gone around the corner? There's basically a wall in the way. Oh. No, see. I think no, the problem is else like we've been able to see walls, whereas there's just a black line across here. Right, that's what I'm confused about. Yeah, like once 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 you move, like say here, you would see all of this, and then it would be visible. <laughs> no, the problem I'm having is north. What here, where I've just pinged? Yes. yes. Yeah. yeah, that that's that's. I assume that's supposed to be a kind of wall, because yeah, there's it's, another it's section of the map up there. Which... Got it. Okay. Yeah. That's that was my okay. I was like, I have dark vision. I should be able to see things. <laughs> Sorry oh, for the confusion. Yeah. Sorry for everybody. I yes. imagine. Oh, is the vampire spawn is... that weird? The gray thing. Is that where? Okay. Queen? Yes. Yes. Uh, so to everybody who's wondering why they can't see Kithana, we're looking at a screenshot because I can't see where they are because we split the party! Yay! That's right. Yes. Wait, should I have lost track? Oh, I was here. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Are you dashing as well, are you? No, I'm, I'm just I'm moving dashing. twice and stopping. Ah, uh, pie. Dashing and daring. Yeah, Rages your second movement carry. is a dash. Yes. Please say that was where you were going with that. Yes. Good. Okay, I'm done. Okay. Go ahead, Maximilius. Okay. Um, I'm not really going anywhere. I've just got to close the door.
and he's going to use how to buy vicious mockery that vampire spawn and it only does half damage so I get really quiet for everybody else. Sorry. Quite quiet. Uh -huh. Quite quiet. Yeah, so so uh, Maximilius is going to cast Vicious Mockery um, at, at the Vampire Spawn, um, but it, I guess, succeeded its um, wisdom saving throw, and so it only took half damage. Vampires are difficult to mock, apparently. I mean, oh, they're just a little bit dead inside already, aren't they? Oh, a little bit. No, um, sorry, I got this mixed up <laughs> with something else. It doesn't take any damage. There we go. And that no is... damage. Oh, no. Yep. Oh, is Vicious Mockery a cantrip? It's kind of cool, though. Okay, um, this giant frog is going to move up to... I have an updated screenshot from somewhere. Uh, it's still probably better from Quinn or Kaythana. Give me a second. I think I Ice has got it. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're more central anyway. You can see a bit more, I think. Um, and then this other giant frog is going to try to attack this poisonous snake. Oh, this is my screen right. that we're looking at. Okay, sorry. This one we get live. My brain has just gone. Hang on. <laughs> Poor Pi. Running two combat simultaneously. With NPCs. Allied We're the NPCs. worst. This is so mean. I'm so sorry. We were just worst. looking down the corridor and suddenly got initiative. <laughs> there we go. Um, so this this frog bit the poisonous snake for uh, five damage. Yes. Nice. Go frog. Go froggy. Go froggy. That was Simmy froggy, we love you. And vampire this spawn. vampire spawn is going to attack Quinn. Oh. It's not nice. I mean, I deserve it. <laughs> so everyone can see Fight. why there is an issue. And it hits with 11, so it misses. It does miss. Yeah. Thank God. Just bend out of its way. You don't want to become like a, a vampire elephant? That sounds badass. Mm, I would <laughs> not to. I wonder if I can become a vampire robot. Um, only one way to find out. No. <laughs> Bite um, me. Okay. Uh, so this this giant constrictor snake is going to attack the frog. Seeing as this one is a live one, I'm going back to here. With a bite. Does hit. And this frog is not doing so hot. Because he's cold blooded. Oh, frog. Oh, <laughs> dumb. That, that one okay. hurt. Um, that was physically painful. <laughs> <laughs> now, now it's Vampire Spawn B's turn. Um, so it's going to move up to Redeemer and attempt a bite. I'm assuming that's on the right. B sounds cyberpunk. Yeah, it's over this side here. Oh. Okay. Oh. And. Oh. 
Each time I'm trying to take a screenshot, dice are getting in the way. Sorry. It's all good. It's not your fault. Well, it was quite lucky. That one though. goes in the apology jar. No. What? <laughs> I mean, they I were my dice. I apologize was... for dice. <laughs> Red's so... reading chat, not paying attention. Just one more d6 called out so 19 um, 19 um, I, do I still have the temporary hit points went before yep. yes yeah, okay so that goes down to zero okay and that is <laughs> its turn and it's redeemer's turn uh, yeah redeemer's gonna definitely gonna back uh, here so that the dice are visible Swing back. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh my god. Is this because I'm looking at the dice? Yep, it's probably, it's it probably is. because... Start closing your eyes. Today, arguably one of the more focused people, the more, more combat, like, martial people is just missing every attack, so... Yeah. Um, okay, um, and then I suppose as a bonus action... No, nah, no, nah, I'm just going to have my turn. Carry on. It's now Frogo's hmm. turn. Whoa! I can see through the wall. Was yeah. that intentional? Ooh, me too. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I moved one of the walls so everyone could see everyone. Um, but you can't move uh, through the wall. So, yeah. You're amazing. <laughs> Hi, you thank amazing. you. Hundred <laughs> percent. Naps for pie. Okay. Um, so now it is this frog's turn, and it's going to go for the snake. Oh, it best be moving out of the way. <laughs> Harris will kill a frog to kill a snake. Like, it just needs to move diagonally north. Look, you're a bear with frog armor. <laughs> I am a useless bear that cannot hit it if it doesn't fucking move. <laughs> and it it also misses. We just <laughs> we just need that clip to be the I am a useless bear. <clears throat> yes. And now it is Terrace's turn. <laughs> it really did not move. It, it did it honestly not move. <laughs> it, it moved into range to attack, so I am, I am sure they're. It could have moved not that high. a little bit. They're not that intelligent. I don't give a damn. <laughs> really, it's gonna stand in front of a grumpy fucking bear. I mean, god, oh, fuck, wow, <laughs> oh my fucking god. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to bite the snake in front of me. When it's is it my turn? It's my turn, isn't it? Yes. Yep, right, it I'm biting the fucking snake in front of me. Sixteen hit. It does. Five damage. Five <laughs> piercing. Um, it is on its last leg. Oh my As god! It doesn't have a leg. I was gonna. <laughs> <laughs> It's on its last toe. They they have, have like no. no they no, don't no, have no. toes. Not 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 a toad. It's a frog. Oh, <laughs> I didn't attack a frog yet. It was my next go. Now I'm gonna have to go for, right clawing it. I'm just swiping. Oof. Twenty to Wait, hit and seen? eight slashing damage. Yeah. You 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 mutilate the snake. <clears throat> and it lands on the frog that's in the way, and I growl at it. <laughs> That the is the end of my turn. The snack. <laughs> the frog just eats it and be like, "Ah!" Oh, like it literally just that. gets gets snake to the face. All right. That means it's my turn. Excellent. Uh, All right. One moment. We are attacking the vampire spawn again. Uh, unarmed strike. Away. Okay. Uh, 22 to hit. Yep, that hits. Or 6 damage. Just 
And then, assuming it's still up. Yep. <laughs> Eight does not hit, I would assume. Nope. That is disappointing. That is the end of my turn. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. That does make sense. A lot of pieces. snake can't go. I was like, oh, I have to wait for the snake. Oh, the snake's dead. Interesting. Um... Hmm. So, Tazzy's instinct is to inflict wounds, but what is the... It's necrotic damage. If it's already dead, does it... I don't think that matters in this sense. Or does... I think it works for, like, zombies but I don't think that's how it works for vampires. If you do something that does radiant damage, it will stop them from healing. We've already sussed that out, I think. Mm -hmm. Right. So any in any wound that you inflict with radiant is better. Yeah. So if you have like guiding bolts or... Um, no, Alana uh, does my other character. Um, I can either inflict wounds contained. or I have a warhammer. Hit it with a warhammer. The, the Warhammer is <clears throat> Warhammer is better than this. That was my question. Well, it, 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 oh. I don't I don't know if it. A vampire isn't technically, I mean, it is an undead, but yeah, it's, it, it's its flesh is kind of like heals and is almost alive, if that makes sense. Whereas, it, like a zombie, it's all rotting anyway. I, I don't, vampires don't rot and such today. Because the difference so is it's... between one d10 of damage and three d10 of damage. So, like, inflict wounds is better. The question is, is a spell slot. Well, so yeah, I so have several. <laughs> what What are you trying to ask? I guess is the, the question, question is. I know some things are immune to certain kinds of damage. Is it immune to necrotic damage, being that it is dead? Um, it has resistances to it. Yes. Got it. Um, okay. Which Which you guys have seen previously? Um, I think it was the second time you fought Vampire Spawn. Right, I figured at this point, Kaythana has fought them enough that she would have picked up on it. Tazzy doesn't know a goddamn thing. Um, okay, Warhammer it is. I have a question. That did has anyone happen. yelled out for telling Taras that you're in battle? No, I think being no. assaulted by vampires and not knowing where you are is like, probably... Has, has you could at least... yelled out that you're in battle? I'm bellowed! <clears throat> bellowed at the fucking frog, it's really though. fucking badly. Like, that's not out of the ordinary for terrorists. There's though. a hallway. <laughs> 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 There's a corner. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's <this> mess. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to go rescue my dog. Okay. Okay. From herself <laughs> she's woo wooing in someone i don't know <laughs> okay um well i think it's not your turn for a bit yep go for okay, it so yeah i'll be back okay Sorry. um 21 hits doing... yes okay i think i would have probably picked it up like this and tried to yeah you're good i I assumed, um, also yeah. since it's a Warhammer. Yes, it is large. I am medium. So, okay, and I'm done. Eight damage, and it's Max's turn. Okay. All right, so, um, Max sees that Quinn has taken some damage, and he is going to... Cast Healing Word. Sweet, sweet healing. Five health points. Oh, yes. 
Very nice. And then... He's going to move up and attack with his rapier. So, so eight, yeah. He does eight damage. There we go. Frog. Yeah, this one. Okay. Um, this frog is going to do a standing leap and basically jump. To the other side of mm -hmm. the um, other side of the vampire spawn, and then it is going to bite with advantage since it's flanking. And nice. See what this frog's doing. got more skill than me. I know it's a logistics thing, but the idea of biting with advantage is so funny to me. It does. Four points of damage. Advantageous chomping. Okay, and then now it is the other frog's turn. Um, it is going to try to attack this snake since it's on its way out. Fight or flight. It's got to fight. Or it's right. Party? Party. <clears throat> and it does six points of damage. And then it moves away and gets attacked. No more frog. Frog is gone. <clears throat> frog dead. Oh no. Thank you for your service, Froggy. Which frog died? Number two. One of the giant, one of the giant frogs next to you. So you the, oh, <laughs> the one near me. Okay. But not... Oh no! It's now not in my way. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Okay. Okay. Settle that's, down. That's what's important. Not <laughs> not that it sacrificed down. itself. And... <clears throat> no. That poor frog. Um, <laughs> that poor frog. <laughs> As the bear too, steps over its corpse. And excited. Okay. Um, now it's this vampire spawn's turn again, and it's going to try to bite Quinn. Oh, that's All a miss. Right. And that is that. Now it is the Constrictor's turn, and it is going to go for this frog with a bite. Oh. Bye, frog. Wow. Wow. And that frog is gone. There's a big lump in that snake right now. The dead yeah. kind of dead. Two frog-shaped shapes in that frog's mm. in that frog's belly and that snake's belly. Okay, and now it's the other vampire spawn's turn, and it is going to attack Maximilius. No, poor Max. Sorry, buddy. Oh no, we got you into this mess. At least it didn't crit, Max. Oh, no. This vampire doing work, I'm telling you right now. Yeah, Are you guys right, going to yell for help yet? Work. No. <laughs> I don't need help. <laughs> Max might. <laughs> and now it is Redeemer's turn. 
Hey, I get advantage on this as well, don't I? I don't need it this time. Although I should probably do it anyway, just um, just in case we double it. No, apparently not. Um, so anyway, I'll roll damages on the first one, which is 12. Hmm. Nice. Hmm. Okay. Um, and I will smite with that. Divine smite. Um, which one? I can move these out of the way. We'll do 2d8. Plus an extra d8 from all the fact that they're undead. Wow. Oh. Nice. So that's 28 damage. Of which 16 of it is radiant. Damn. Okay. Um, it is still doing its thing. It's, uh, you know, it's showing some wear and tear, but. Um, yeah, it's 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 definitely still alive. Okay. Um... <clears throat> yeah, that's me done. That's me done. There are okay. Terra sister. <clears throat> no one's yelled for me, so I don't know if there's a problem, and I don't know where they are. So I'm just gonna bellow louder. Um. <laughs> Marco! Step, yeah, basically Gondor Marco. calls for aid. <clears throat> Gondor calls for aid. <laughs> Light the beacons, bitches! <laughs> um, and I'm going to bite and claw um, this freaking snake. So I'm going to go claws first. Uh, 25 to hit for 10 slashing okay. damage. Okay. And then 17 to hit. Yep. With 10 piercing damage. You are not Correct. going back outside. Basically, just a rake and a bite. And... Yeah, basically, I pounced on it with my claws out and <laughs> then just grabbed it and then let go and jumped back a bit. Okay. Um, it's Quen's turn. Or, unless you have anything else. No, that's that's me done. I have I have yelled really loudly. Did they hear me? It was loud. We're gonna we're gonna continue the beatings until morale improves. Um, Alan, <laughs> get it done. Like 10, 10 health points. Like whoa, stop! I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, twenty one to hit for. Seven damage on this okay. vampire spawn, and then uh, oh, does a 14 hit? Um, 14 does not hit, does not hit. Damn, that's it. That is me, unfortunately. I'm just punching, 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 punching. I am going to. Warhammer this motherfucker again. Uh, this time while yelling. <sighs> but it does a nine. Nine doesn't hit, does it? Not hit. Why? Why does it roll one-handed damage and two-handed damage separately like that? Like, why would it sometimes be more for one and sometimes because more for two? You have a versatile weapon. So it rolls different die. Mm. Okay. Depending well, whether you're holding it two-handed or one-handed. Also, okay. if you if you move so that you're opposite Quinn, you would get advantage. Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, can I move now that I failed at hitting? Yeah. Okay, and great. Still have your movement. I'm gonna do that, and I did scream. Go ahead, Max. Wait, you screamed. Okay. Yep. Okay. Ah! That kind of scream. <laughs> no words, just like. Like a battle roar, oh, is it? Yeah, sort of like, like a, a panic crime. rage situation. Mm. 
Come on, Max. Got this, buddy. I believe in you. We believe in you, Max. Maximilius, the combat Thank frog. <laughs> Wait, are you sure you don't want to be a bard? Oh, 100%. <laughs> I mean, you could cross class. <laughs> no, I'm okay. If I was going to cross class, it'd be in something that didn't require quite so much roleplay. <laughs> this character's hard enough for me. <laughs> Um, Max is going to use um, Vicious Mockery on the Vampire Spawn. Oof. Swing and a miss. Oh, yikes. Well, that was a Wisdom yeah. Saving Throw for the Vampire Spawn, so it hits. Oh, that yeah, was three yeah, damage. yeah. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, I pulled good. the wrong one. Yes. Good. Uh, so three damage. Sorry, I'm so used to the opposite way. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah. Then that's the end of his trip. Okay, so this giant frog is going to try to bite the vampire spawn again with advantage yeah oh i only clicked that like eight times sorry about that guys hi you are racking them up tonight not the hungry eyes Ooh, no frog. the apologies seven damage nice and uh uh, Maximilius looks over and he's like, Hey, um, I made those. And uh, that's the end of that frog's turn. And <laughs> now it's the vampire spawn's turn. And it is going to try to bite the frog. Oh, wait, I thought that was the other one. What's that? Sorry, I thought the one on the left was the was the vampire that you were this time. Oh, for some reason it was selected. That's my bad. Um, okay. I was just a little confused about which one was which. That's all. It doesn't really matter. They both go before me, but. All right. So this one is going to uh, bite Quinn. It does not hit. God. <laughs> then They've the been hitting hard. They have been. <laughs> going to attempt to constrict Terrace. Eleven. It's going in for a hug. That's the AC of the bear, isn't it? Eleven. Oh, you're muted. Red. Oh, muted again. You're muted. That's my bear AC. I'm typing. I'm making a command. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not paying attention. I was paying attention. I was listening. I just didn't realize I'd oh. muted because of my keyboard. So 11 <laughs> does hit. 11 hits because that's my AC. Okay. Um, so that says the bare minimum. Yeah. Um, right. um. Oh, no. <laughs> that, no, that was amazing. <laughs> 12. <laughs> 12 damage. <laughs> Um. And you are grappled. I just want uh, you to know that all I'm hoping for once Terrace hears our yells is for her to come busting through the wall <laughs> like the Kool Aid bear that she is. I half expected to be with the constrictor wrapped around them as well. <laughs> yeah. Just starts running. Sorry, I'm trying to find. There's me searching on my character sheet. How do I change my freaking hit points? Uh, you do it in your notebook. Because that's <laughs> where you're tracking it. I'm starting to look a bit rough around the edges. Not that there's anyone to see you. <laughs> two, two dead frogs and a snake. 
<laughs> okay, um, now it's this other vampire spawn's turn. Um, it's going to attack this frog. The bite. No, little froggos. Okay, and then damage. That's a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. But the frog is still doing its it's doing its thing. It's frogging oh. along. Um, Go on, froggy, you got this. Um, now it's redeemer's turn. Bam! Oh, that was terrible. Uh, but luckily, advantage, right? Bam! Mm -hmm. That's a lot better. Much and better. Then... Oof. Quite a chunky 13 points of damage. And I won't be doing anything extra. Okay. Um, that is the end of my turn. How's that vampire looking in front of me? Is it, uh, is it still standing? Perhaps? Hopefully looking pained. What's that? Hit pretty hard. Sorry. The vampire in front of me. Is it Oh it it's it's looking rough. It 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 it's it's still up, but it's it's not it's not pretty, so Okay, good. Mess it up. Darius. You know what? I don't care that I'm grappled. It makes it closer. I'm just going to hug it with my claws and bite it while it's grappling uh, me. I'm just going to use its own self grappling me to just like rend it. Um, do a strength, I guess, check. We both have to do a con contested If I'm just strength. grappled, it just stops my movement. I'm not restrained. I'm grappled, right? Oh, oh gotcha, gotcha. Uh, I'll deal with grapple too often. Yeah, it's just to to escape from it. it um, so if it's if it's just a grapple, then I can still attack. I just can't move. It's if I'm if right. if, if I'm restrained, I can't attack. Right. Go for it. Okay. 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 Right. Uh, claws. There's a twenty-three yeah. hit. <laughs> yeah, twenty-three. <laughs> Fourteen slashing damage, and the bite. He's 21 to hit with 9 piercing damage. Oof. Um, you, you feel the uh, the snake kind of loosen up a little bit, but then it comes back and, and keeps grappling you. Chuck. That's one tough snake. Mm. It is, but that is the end of I my mean, go. I mean, it is 15 feet square. <laughs> it's a lot of snake. Oops, all snake. Exactly. Um... My go got skipped, I think. Can I go back? Oh. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Oh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> we both went back. Okay. All right. More beatings. More beatings. Does a 14 hit? Uh, 14 does not hit. Damn. Uh... Continue attempts to hit. There's 15 a 15 does hit. hit. 15 does, thank God for that. That's uh, 6 damage to this vampire spawn. Okay. We have an ad break that's about to hit. Um, so take this opportunity to get some self care. We're going to go off camera while the ads play so that you don't miss anything. Um, we will be back really, really soon. It's just a three minute ad break to keep the pre rolls away. Get some self care, check your blood sugar, and take your meds if it's time for meds. Get a drink, and we'll be back really soon.
Welcome back. And uh, it is Kithana's turn. All right. I am again going to take the Warhammer, bash it down on the vampire spawn in front of me. And this time I roll with advantage. Mm hmm. Yep. 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 So I'll just click the button twice. Hope that does something. And I'm yelling this time as well. So does the 14 hit? Uh, 14 does not hit. All right. Well, that was fun. Next. It's so, it's so disappointing. <laughs> I was like, mm, okay. I uh, bounces off the wall with a clang. Um. <laughs> These vampires have a reasonable AC. I'm actually going to go back to Kathana and remind her she has Bardic Inspiration and to add oh. a 2 to her hit. And advantage. She she rolled advantage. She got a 7 and a 14. Yeah. Oh, I didn't but see she, the 7. But, oh. but she, she can turn that 14 into a 16. Bardic Inspiration is just plus 2. Because that's what I rolled whenever I did it. Ah, okay. It well, does... 2 to whatever roll. So I'm taking away the little sunshine thing. Does the 16 hit? Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Uh, 10 points of damage to Sir Vampire spawn in front of me. Okay. Um, it, it basically reels back and just kind of looks at you angry. With just some Valid. going down his face. So All right. To, um, What's the goal? <laughs> make that a holy weapon somehow. Um, now it's Maximilius' turn. Uh, there is a spell for that. Is. No, there is. Okay, cool. And if you have a kind GM, you're allowed to cast it on the monk's fists. <gasps> that is <Not> cool. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> what about on the wraps the monk might be wearing on their hand? Ooh. Probably need to find some. <laughs> Big enough for elephant hands. I mean, they're just wraps. I just need to find the right item, I guess. That's true. No. <sighs> oh, no. Uh, that does not hit. So that is Maximilius' turn. No, Maximilius. Go, Froggo. It's the chosen frog. <laughs> this frog is... Still it's going. Chosen one. At least it's got uh, advantage. It's yeah. This frog is um... the one told in tales. Um, so it hits for two, uh, three piercing damage. And now it is vampire spawn A's turn. Um, it is going to attack Kithana with a bite. Uh, does I've just hit. noticed. Oh, it does not. Thank God. We can see Pi's she rolls now. Yes. I've been rolling in uh, Foundry um, instead of rolling from Beyond 20. Yeah, okay. Or uh, uh... Demon. Uh... Okay, uh, now the giant constrictor snake is going to attempt to bite. It's going to go badly. Terrace. Rot roll. And we will see how this goes. Oh! Shit! That's that a hits. Hit. <laughs> 13. Shit! Guess what? I was going to say, uh -oh. how many points does a bear have anyway? Uh, my bear had 34 plus 5, temporary. Oh. Hmm. Um, I have been whittled away slowly to 12 previously, and 13 takes me back to being a halfling, and oh. takes that one extra hit point off my halfling. Oh, I mean, that's not bad. <laughs> yes, but, but I'm now a halfling. It tanked 40 HP before you uh, became a halfling. That's well, at nice. least you're not at zero, which no. is what I thought you were going to tell us. No. Yeah, I <laughs> did think that was where I thought it was going. 
Being like, a halfling oh. is much better than being at zero. Uh, not bare ass anymore. Now you're just terrace. Wow. Um, <laughs> real thing you said out loud in your real adult voice. <laughs> that no. was an outside voice way. <laughs> <laughs> um, this vampire spawn is going to attempt to attack the giant frog. No, not the frog. That's the chosen frog. <gasps> yes, that's a nutty one. <laughs> this frog, this frog is carrying. I'm telling you now. <laughs> this frog is a badass. Look, so long as the like, bad guys I, are the ones running the ones. I, I just imagine Redeemer is saying this, and like <laughs> Maximilius is like. <laughs> <laughs> he thinks really high of me. This is awesome. <laughs> the frog's just over there like. <laughs> um, and now it's Redeemer's turn. Um, yeah, just swing that sword. Oh, for goodness sake, Redeemer. Oh, for goodness sake. Oof. Wow. Ouch. Redeemer, uh, after that, just puts their sword away. Um, <laughs> bare fist the rest of the it. just forget it now oh dear well that was fun let's try again <laughs> start time fresh <laughs> time to reset <laughs> all right all right terrace the halfling terrace the halfling who is <laughs> actually constricted i have a question yes did it lose its grip when I went <laughs> from being back. a large character mm. to a small? Um, roll me a dex save. Or, or or just a dex check. I want to see if Terrace is fast enough to get out as, as the uh, shrinking happens. Yep. You're out. Nice. Sweet. Very slippery. As... <laughs> Oh, God. As I'm currently in this form, <laughs> I'm going to yell, Guys, there's a fucking snake! And it's all really we big! Is... Help! All we hear is, Guys, there's a snake. <laughs> Wait, how thick is this wall? <laughs> I mean, well, it's, it's, it's only going to go around this corridor. Gonna, and It's, it's probably... going to bounce off two walls. <laughs> yeah. So, so that's going to that's gonna echo it. So you'll hear it. You'll hear it. <laughs> okay. I'm exceptionally okay. fucking loud at this point. And then with it's... that said, I'm going to wild shape back into the fucking bear. What? Wait, you can do that? Yep, it's a bonus action. <laughs> what in the world? Two, two a day between short rests. And uh, I'm going to bonus action back into a bear. And uh, bite and slash this bastard. I forgot how tanky druids are. Like they, um, they get a little. Um... <sighs> what? I would have assumed if it brought you down that you can't re-verify. But no, right. you can. It's great. S something, something saving our big spells until you know the end of the dungeon. Something, something. <laughs> Not a big spell. <laughs> Wild shape lasts an hour. I don't intend to die on my own. I need the extra hit points to soak this shit up. No good to you in a big battle if I'm dead. <laughs> That's my theory. We should just uh, take a nap. Claws. Here is Fuck. The that nap missed. Here in the sewers. And bite. Yep. Oof. That hit. We can't I tell you're not. rolling privately again. That oh, was wait. one. But That's not. That's not a happy face though. Oh. A one. Does that mean because you, you know, you missed, you accidentally poked yourself with your claw, and now you turn back ideas. into a half elf again? No, I probably just <laughs> put my Not face in shitty like, water. It's, it's like, it's like when you stand up too fast and you get dizzy from from the initial like rush of blood. <laughs> because I've gone from shoo, the wild shape. You went, you went down. Like... <laughs> but at least I got out of its out of its constriction, so that's done at least. Uh, and I'm back up to 34 hit points. Yeah, I was going to say, you technically healed a bunch there. Technically. Technically. So. technically. Okay, it's Quinn's turn. Quinn. Hmm, okay. Let's, um, let's actually see if we can, we can hit again, because, you know, that's actually fun. Uh... Sixteen uh, hit. That does hit. Yep. Oh, thank God. 
Uh, <laughs> as they so say in uh, many car movies, punch it. Um, punch it. That's six damage. <clears throat> okay. Still up? Yep, it is still up. Bastard. Okay. That's another one! So that, that went well. No, the 14 yeah. misses. It's really the way more misses. 1s and 20s today than it should be statistically yeah. like. Mm, yep. Whatever the RNGC so... for this is terrible. I'm, I'm, I'm going to say it's it's probably to do with their announcement today. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. They've, like, increased the odds. Yeah. All right. Well, that's the end of my turn after making contact once. Kaithana. At least you made oh. contact once. I did, yes, this is true. I am <laughs> you been attempting to hammer away at <laughs> this fucking vampire. Uh rolling with advantage. Yes? Yes, yes. you are. Yep. Yes. Okay. There we go. Um no, I'll, I'm, not, I'll I'm, not, I'm not sorry, but uh, I assume that you were saying you were rolling with, with advantage. No, I was asking. Yeah. Um, uh, you're, ten you're right damage to this asshole. <laughs> and <laughs> I'm still yelling wordless rage as I pound it's down like, on it. It's like Terrace is back there like, this is snake, snake, snake. And you're like, this is my apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Functionally, I mean, you know, if if you think about it logically, the vampires are the scarier threat. So Terrace wants us to give up fighting these vampires. Right, deal that's with the other snake. thing. Like, what am I gonna do? Stop? Like, yeah. <laughs> Terrace, like, help! There's a snake, and we're like, ah, uh, vampire. <laughs> oh dear. Hey, it's Maximilius. Okay, it's Maximilius' turn. And he is going to... Just gonna do a good old rapier attack. Swishy swish, as I like to call the rapier swish, attacks. Swish swash thrust. Uh, <laughs> There's that. Oh, thank you. Well, does that hit? Yeah, that hits. Oh, so 15 is the AC. Metagaming. <gasps> Sorry, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> okay, that's eight points of damage. Uh, <laughs> this vampire spawn is not looking so hot. Good. This one just keep this one's still going though. This one's taking mm. a lot of damage because I hit it for <laughs> 28 plus like what was the second one? Like 15 or something? Yep. Yeah, they take a bit of uh, this giant tough... frog is going to try to bite it once again. This giant frog's done more damage than all of us. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> it's still going. Let's get it go. Oh. Well. Jinxed it. Damn it! My fault. Sorry, Froggy. <laughs> it just glares at you. <laughs> Not hungry eyes anymore. <laughs> no, that was a completely different frog. The, uh, that was a different frog, was it? <laughs> yeah. Is that frog still around down the bottom? No. Yeah. No, yeah, no. Hungry eyes frog is still alive. Just He's down here, right? Over. Hungry eyes is all yeah. the way down here. Further down, yep. Um, Alright, so it's this vampire spawns turn and it is going to attack Quinn with a bite. Mm, that hits. And the damage. Oh, 11. Yeah, okay. That hurt. That one tickled, didn't it? Mm. <laughs> and then glad for those this... temporary hit points I had. It is the snake's turn, and I feel I should wait, but also, yeah. So, who, 
who's looking worse seeing that they're both in front of me? Uh, Quinn or the vampire? Um, Quinn. Uh... Quinn looks worse than the vampire. Yep. Okay. So the question is... You don't want to heal the vampire. I can assure you that. <laughs> Please don't <laughs> heal the vampire. Please. Okay. Wait, what? Why? Because we don't want the vampire to heal? You could, yeah, oh. <laughs> Clip it. This, okay. is, this Clip isn't it. one of those games where healing hurts vampires. And... <laughs> no, but like, I guess I haven't... I don't remember what happened previously with vampires. So if we get them, what's the goal? We want to kill them. No, like, Pi was making a joke about whether or not you were going to heal me or heal the vampire. Mm. Oh. Based on which one was looking better. I understand. <laughs> I thought you said, please don't kill the vampire. Oh, which no, is... no, no, no. Okay. And I imagined this whole thing that, like, when they get down to zero hit points, they regenerate, but one is fine. And I was like, what? <laughs> okay, fine. All right. No, what I'm trying to debate is whether whether I would say, okay, let me pause and heal Quinn, or whether I would say, let me keep bashing this motherfucker. How bad do you look, Quinn? I'm doing all right. Like you're doing okay. Yeah, okay. Um, as much as that was a lot of damage to take, it was mainly temporary hit points that was wiped out. So. Okay. All right. Fine. And and it is the giant constrictor snake's turn. And it is. I see. I came back in time to die. It's gonna bite You'll be <laughs> fine, Terrace, or attempt to. I just realized one of my last captions was Coronavirus Island, but I have no idea why. Why? What could I have possibly said that would be translated to Coronavirus Ireland? I don't know, but 20... 14... 14 damage. 14 damage. Right, that takes me down to 20. Cool. There's a tough... And then here's yeah, but I only have spawn. 11 AC. Sorry. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, that's so interesting. Will that go up as you level up in... No. no. Why would bears only have 11? Can we build you bear armor? I mean, it's a big yes. bear. Who's this attacking? The frog. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. Oh, Unfortunate, froggy. but understandable. Particularly unfortunate because Redeemer won't have advantage anymore. I mean, Redeemer Unless could Max just move around. That he can. Like True. clockwise can around. Yeah. Yeah, because I can't move there because there's a wall. But um, Redeemer now has their fists up. They're sick of their sword. So they're, <laughs> they're going to do like some boxing sidestepping to go whoop. Whoop. And uh yeah, go for the go for the little go for a little you know, a little jab. So an unarmed strike with a natural twenty apparently. Oh um, my god. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I'm not even gonna bother rolling the advantage, uh but yeah, rolling damage, which apparently comes to a whole ten damage. <laughs> ten because it would be five times two. <laughs> so so Redeemer goes from where he's at. Or where where they're at, uh, moves over, moves over, moves over, and then just knocks its head off, just like one point. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a little bit, just just a little bit of residual like s divine smite left in him as he as he does it. So can I, glowing can I... fist goes forward, pulsating fist. <laughs> please please no, please just roll a glowing it again. Fist. No pulsating. What what are we rolling again? Just roll your roll your unarmed um, strike roll again, just to see. Yeah, roll d twenty again. Please. Okay. okay. <laughs> I feel like maybe there's a set pool of how many ones and twenties we will get through this entire game, and we're just draining it today. We're just <laughs> using all of them. We're never eventually gonna get it's, another it's, anything. <laughs> eventually, it's just gonna be eights and thirteens like forever. <laughs> right. uh, um. 
as my uh, bonus action, Redeemer is going to step next to the frog, uh, kneel down, and just just pat it on the head and say, that'll do. That'll do, that'll do frog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that'll do. <laughs> and that's the end of uh, Redeemer's turn. Mm. That'll do frog. That'll do. <laughs> Oh dear. It's Terra's sister. Ha! <sighs> she's just she's gonna roar again. <laughs> and then she's gonna claw it. Yep. 14 hit? Yep. Or no, uh, sorry. The oh, I saw the 22. Yeah, but 14 does hit. Sorry about that. <laughs> 14 hit, um, so that's 11. Yeah. And so you, you just basically rake it and it just kind of like hangs on your hand as it dies right I'm taking it with me um oh yeah. no <laughs> i'm going trophy. back for the others oh i haven't got a move a grizzly snake trophy yes I'm, I'm keeping my grizzly snake trophy i'm i'm just i'm not going to detach it from my claws so i'm just gonna stomp down the thing so so is this going to squelch as you're going along, being 20, dragged behind 25, you? 30, like a you know what I mean? Three meter long. Like, <laughs> oh my god, you wretched thing. Come on. I can get to there. Oh, now Wait, I can't looking... see everybody. I can't see you. Like, okay, yeah, so I'm going to move myself gonna... back oh, so that everybody else is visible for, for here, but I'm in this corner down the bottom. This, this snake is like 45 feet long. <laughs> Look at that model. It's What's like, your point? Yeah. I'll drape it around my shoulders like a fantastic feather boa. Scaly boa. <laughs> it's uh, a boa I'm constrictor. Another, Look at that. I'm requesting another fan art of a giant bear with a feather boa boa constrictor. Situation Just on. covered in shit. Oh, and, man. And, and entrails. Don't forget I the entrails. I am fabulous as fuck. There is there is shit dripping from my fur. <laughs> now, technically, my fur was clean again. Not but I've just world. been thrashing in, in the you... shit again. So I'm like <laughs> not, not, not dripping in shit. In and I have a shitty snake draped across my fucking shoulders. I am fabulous, it's... darling. It's That's... it's like when your dog goes outside and rolls in mud and then brings something additional with it. The <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> first of all, drop it. Second of all, everyone here needs a bath. <laughs> Only one of my strikes have hit, and I roll a one for damage. That's four damage to the uh, vampire spawn, and that's the end of my turn. No, it's my fault. I took the only natty twenty available mm. for my, nah, my melee of doom. Terrible. My pulsating fist needed to deal with things. Yes, it did. <laughs> Can someone Sick quote that? Me. My pulsating fist needed to deal with things. <laughs> I just put on a t-shirt. Well, that's the thing. My first thought was I wanted a t-shirt, and then I was like, I can't wear that out of the house. No, you can't. <laughs> what about a coffee mug? I work mug? with children. I work with children. I was going to say, I definitely have a t-shirt I can't wear outside of work. I'll show it to you guys some other time. That's a mug I can't even offer guests. <laughs> you put masking tape over it. But anyway. Anyway. Kithana. Uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and bash this motherfucker with a hammer again, <clears throat> uh, with advantage. This this one on the left just seems unkillable. It, it, it really does. It really is. An eleven doesn't rolling. hit, does it? Nope. Okay. It's like death by a thousand cuts <laughs> with you two over there, just constantly. <laughs> Except they're cuts, not though, cutting it. No, but you're bludgeoning it to death with elephant <laughs> fists and, and a hammer. <laughs> you know those things where it's like two little figurines who are like back and forth popping on a hammer on a little bell with their little hammers? That's mm. what's happening right now. Have you ever seen the way they make mochi? Like with the, yeah, you know, they're the the smacking yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just, just you two taking it in turns against this guy. Because then sometimes they put their hands in as well, don't they? And, and do something with it. 
um, and they miss, they time it between the hammer strikes. They put their hands in to do something. I, I feel like that's what that's what um, Quinn is doing, just punching between the hammer strikes. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, Crazy. Max, go right ahead. Uh, he he tried attacking with his rapier and missed. Um, and just basically like stabbed at the wall. And now. Well, he tried. The vampire spawn will attempt to bite Max. Not Max. And then again, a vampire frog would be pretty awesome. Mm. I don't know if Merlin can fix that. <laughs> don't oh. think Merlin would want to. Oh, Max. 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 Max goes down. What? No, buddy. Stop. Someone call Miss no. Piggy. <laughs> Context. <laughs> okay, it is Redeemer's turn. <laughs> it's Redeemer's turn, is it? Uh, Redeemer, yeah. see Max go down, goes, not another one! And we'll charge over and um, and uh, lay on hands, because um, I assume uh, Maximilian is just unconscious. Um, yeah. And we'll lay on hands all remaining 10 HP that I can funnel. Um, we could do the, the, the router noise again if you want, the, you know, the old fashioned dial up. We'll do that noise as well. I want to talk to whoever named these spells. Who looked at something and was like, I'm going to call it Lay on Hands in a game for mostly grown ups. I'm sure that'll go fine. Uh, Tazzy, you don't want an answer to that question? <laughs> no, I, I don't actually. I just like, <laughs> I want to reflect on this for a moment. Um, I think it's a bad idea. And um, I, I think. Yeah, I think that's going to be my turn. So it's an action, um, so yeah. So, Max so I was back up. I was down the bottom in this corner here. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40 puts me here. Uh, I can double move, so I'm going to come all the way up to here. Um, Sorry, the reason I haven't done it to anybody who's just coming yeah. in no, is I because know. of the wall yeah Visuals. and i'm just gonna bellow raw <laughs> I'm just gonna Uselessly. Be like, well it's about time what have you been oh oh as i see this. <laughs> <laughs> comes in 15 <laughs> minutes late with starbucks and a snake <laughs> <laughs> i'd imagine if the snake is being dragged as well the snake's body is going to be like yeah, it's coming round the corner. <laughs> it's going round the corner. The body literally goes all the way down here and is, is uh, its tail is like here around the corner. She comes. <laughs> <laughs> That's one big old snake. <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to look in here. Like, I've still got movement <laughs> left. I can't do much. I'm going to stand on these bodies and look down here. Just <gasps> see what's in there. Is there anything down there? Um, it's it, it's basically just a room. Uh, there are some supplies. Um, looks looks like uh, there was a campfire at one point in this area. So that's that's my turn. I'm done. Cool. All right. Let us see if I can actually hit something again because that would be joyous. <laughs> that's be nice. much. Much better. 24 mm -hmm. to hit, so we will drop uh, 5 points of damage into this thing. Then hope for a better roll. There we go. Much better. Yep. For another 5 damage. Nice. So 10, 10 all up for the round. That is me just okay. socking away at this thing. I know mentally you spelled that S O C K I N G, but that's not the vowel I heard. Anyway, <laughs> um, oh I'm goodness. going to uh, go with the Warhammer again before that gets settled too much. Hey, you uh, hit a 20. Yay, eight damage. Okay, um, it is on its last leg. It's like <laughs> if. If superhero landing was a just a normal pose, this is what it's done. <laughs> um, oh, 
hopefully Maximilian can finish it off. And so... Maximilius is going to do Vicious Mockery. God, I hope this lands. Damn it! Uh, How dare! And let's see, that is his turn. It is now the vampire spawn's turn, and it is going to attack Quinn. No, I half expected it to transform or, like, you know, heal <laughs> or do some kind of clutch thing. Fly away as a bat, anything. Mm -hmm. Shit. Shit. That's good damage as well. Oh, no. it's not good damage. It's bad damage. No. Um, um, <laughs> is it like a? Huh, 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 huh. I am not feeling so good. <laughs> oh, it's not quite one of them then. <laughs> now, here's a question. Oh, but if we kill it, then it unvampirifies you, right? In theory. Because it's been biting yeah. at us. Yeah, but well, so so this is a vampire spawn. Um, the actual vampires are are the ones that turn these. Um, with it's it's not a normal vampirism um, situation. Um, there's a little more okay. to it, okay. And you'll you'll find out in the next exciting <laughs> episode. In the next exciting episode of Pocket Dimension Pie. So what I'm saying is like. I mean, first of all, I'm assuming the combat is fast enough that even if it were to affect us and make us become vampires, it's not a problem. But like, it wouldn't be. We're okay. We're not well. vampires. Okay. Yeah. All Can right, I attack fine. diagonally like this? That's fine, is it? Yep. Yes. Yeah, there's no restrictions over diagonal. Um, okay. Um, uh, is it an action or something to draw your weapon? Uh, just a bonus action. Just it's a free action. action. Okay. That's a free action. Unless you're picking it up oh. off the floor. If it's just been holstered, it's a free action. Yep. Oh, okay, yeah. So, okay, so, uh, yeah, after healing uh, Maximilius, who then, unfortunately, <laughs> doesn't manage to do anything, um, uh, Redeemer will just swing their sword. Is it an advantage? Or is it not quite? <laughs> yeah, do um, we count as opposite? <laughs> I mean... Sorry? It's surrounded. There is. Yes. Oh, uh, no better though. I'm not enough. That, that will miss. Um, uh, that's a shame. Oh well. I got. I should have stuck this with the fists. Please, for the record, spawn. don't bugger the vampire spawn though. <laughs> that's unsafe. <laughs> uh, what's Terrace gonna Just do? Just while Sorry. we're on there. Terrace. Barris, what is Barris gonna do? Barris is gonna growl again. <laughs> get out my way! <laughs> <laughs> Move! You're in the bitch, way again! Get out the way! <laughs> Can I attempt to just intimidate it with an epic growl? Um, Only if you can do an epic growl for us. I mean, you can, but what I would suggest is do an improvised weapon attack with the giant snake that you can have. Can I, as a bear? Absolutely. Oh well, my you're gonna go god! For a whip attack. I didn't. I didn't think you were gonna let me. Can, can I? Can I whip? Can I whip my snake back and forth? <laughs> <laughs> Please. Please a forty-five that. meter long a clip snake. And <laughs> perhaps a quote as well. Can I whip uh. my snake back and forth? <laughs> Oh, sorry, 45 feet long snake. Yeah, so I've got a 45 foot snake. If I if I just whip it good, um, <clears throat> just this whole when a vampire comes along, clip, you please. must whip it. Uh, what do you want me to? Um, is it an improvised <laughs> weapon? Can I can I use the thorn whip spell? Do I have a thorn whip spell? Right, it's not a thorn? spell. You need to make an art. No, I was just I was just wondering if you know I could use thorn whip for stats. It's fine. It's like a a dex attack, right? Uh, would it be would it be dex or would it be a, a strength? Um, which one's your highest? Dex. Uh, let's go dex. 
Thank you. What, as a bear? As a bear, dex is higher than strength, is it? Oh. Oh, it's a physical thing. It's a physical thing. Strength is higher. Yeah, then do strength. I was going for strength, but then I was like, I just... I, <laughs> Maybe it's a well-danced bear. I, I like the idea of this. <laughs> I just, I'm just imagining the bear doing, you know, like one of those uh, Jackie Chan movements where they got like the rope and then they're just jumping and they <laughs> swirl it around their legs and then just it's throw just it like... and just the, the snake's head goes forward like as that bit of metal and clamps on. <laughs> I mean, admittedly, I am using the head part as as the yeah. flick, but yeah, I'm, I've, I've basically got it in my claws and I'm like flicking it. Um, 15? Yes. Ooh, oh, actually, do I get advantage? Given it's surrounded? Yeah. yeah. 23. Natural. Oh, if you've got natural 20, then. I was, I, I was, I was, I was hoping. Um, <laughs> all right. What damage does it do? Uh, improvised um, weapons are 1d4 plus your proficiency and strength, I would guess. That's a three plus four is seven. Okay, um, so you seven snake whip grab, damage. You you have this snake <laughs> draped around your neck as you basically pull your like arm like your claw up and basically use the leverage to basically cause the snake to just flail straight down in between everybody and just <clears throat> hit this this uh, vampire spawn and it just goes down and doesn't come back up. <laughs> That's just ridiculous. A round of applause for everybody involved. Bravo, bravo. Um, <laughs> so... Everybody around it is covered in shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes. We've been covered in shit. I wasn't. Ridiculous. Well. <laughs> to avoid it up until now. Sorry. <laughs> In, in a fit of in a rage, ah! Redeemer's just going to start hacking away at the the snake head next to him. So then ah! just like hacking away at no, it. No, no, Terrace is going to try and stop you. She wants to keep it. She wants to keep it. <laughs> oh, there's going to be chunks missing at least. Mm. <laughs> she pull it away. Maximilius just uh. looks at his like like his outfit and everything. He's like, it ain't easy being green. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I love it. Oh. I love it. Um, okay. So I can hear here. Okay. So I tried to say heal and cure at the same time and it didn't go well, but I can do that to some of y'all. I mean, I would definitely appreciate it because I am not looking good. I'm trying um, to not metagame, but also I'm not literally there as Kathana looking at a hurt Loxodon. Yeah, well, you can... You so can. the question is, on a scale of first level to second level spell, how um, hurt are you? <laughs> here's here's the thing. Um, you're out of combat, so uh, you can talk to each other. Yeah. Right. Yeah, but you I'm trying say, to figure out, like... You just say, do you need me to help you out? <laughs> right, but I also don't know, like non-mechanically what are spell slot levels so you could just you could just ask honestly just ask how many like how how much percentage of his hit points is down or you know what yeah and then judge it how from there are you really hurt do i need to give you that because extra boost of healing you would have the visual <laughs> of how many wounds yeah. he has on him right that's yeah. what so, i'm saying like i'm trying to figure out I am at just above ten percent health. Okay, Oof. so we're like I am, I am really, bloodied. really healing. Okay, yeah, I am bloodied and I am looking very rough. So I am going to touch you and cast cure wounds at the second level. I appreciate not, that. Not as effective as I was hoping. That's okay. <clears throat> Um, Fine, nonetheless. Uh, are you still very hurt? Because I can do it again. I'm below half, but if you have a cantrip, that works better. 
Uh, I, I can spare the encounters. dying. Yeah, I can spare the dying, mend you, or guide you. None of those are. Um, so, so Maximilian walks into the the other little alcove. He's like, "Hey guys, there's a uh, a campfire. Looks like we could probably set up camp. Have a and short have a rest. Little, um, have a, have do a, I have a short stay? Have a short rest? Yeah. <laughs> do I see this red thing over here? Yep. Okay, I. I'm going to go closer. What is it? Uh, roll perception. <laughs> that was it is a the, roller coaster. It is, it is the ram trinket that you are looking yes! for. I'm gonna where pocket that. Where's the ram that? trinket thing? Here. Was this where the entrance was? Yeah. 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 That's that's okay. that's where the other. Okay. I'm um, gonna grab that. I'm, I'm gonna stumble over to the campfire and sit the hell down. Um. I'm going to pick that up and then head to the... The gate already. <laughs> I'm... And Kizana, there's... can you come back? We're, we're just going to sit down oh, for no. a mo. No, okay. I'm, I'm picking up the key. I'm not going over oh, there. I'm right. just like, okay. grabbing okay. the key <laughs> oh. and heading to the campfire. I, I thought oh, she was I... like beeline yeah. the That's what I key. thought. I was like, <laughs> no, 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 no. Like, no, 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 no. I'm not. No I'm just no saying more. I'm not looking at it and then walking away from it. I'm looking at it, seeing what it is, picking it up. And yeah, then right. going to sit down for a bit. So um, hold on. I have a lion trinket, a ram trinket, and what was the other one? Dragon. Dragon. How dragon. could you forget the dragon? dragon. Listen, I'm hurt. I've forgotten a lot of right. dragons in Whoa. my life. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, the shade. Oh. Unloved. All right. Utterly unloved. Um. Redeemer will try and search the bodies of the vampire spawn, find out if they were carrying any supplies or anything of use. Um, especially um, the it... one that they punched the head off of. <laughs> oh, you're you're trying to check the the vampire <clears throat> spawns to see if there's yeah, anything on them. Yeah, see if there's anything around like that we can make use of. If there's nothing, then it's just junk. Then fine. But... So, um, so just oh, sorry. Go ahead. Good. Um, the the campfire um, area. It, it looks almost as if somebody started a camp and then had to leave it immediately. So everything's pretty much fresh. The only thing with it is is maybe the bed rolls are a bit damp um, from being there for so long, and there might be some staleness to some of the supplies. But overall, um, it seems like a well stocked camp. Okay. I'm gonna go back to my okay. main screen just because we're not in combat or any of that yep so my first question is a couple times so far uh a place where we couldn't see had surprise roll for initiatives how about these black walls like right behind me for example are those like wall walls yeah okay cool yeah. um second of uh, all well, like like there's there's not an entrance in this area you'd have to go back out to the gate um yeah, so we are, we are walled in with just a small gap leading into the area. So Beautiful. That's what I'm yeah. hoping for. Um, second of all, I am going to pull out my pack and offer as much food and or drink to anyone and everyone who would like so. No. Is that? I can't tell. Oh, no, that frog's dead. Fine. Okay. I don't have enough food for the hungry frogs. Just max the frog. I'm... There's no frogs left, right? No, they all died. Yeah, it has a max. tiny little dead thing, but I couldn't see that. Little. Uh, right. Um, I'm gonna go to the the gap between and like make questioning snuffling noises in the hope that someone tells me whether we're gonna sit down and rest. And like, oh, we're resting. Is. We're resting. Yeah, I think we're yeah. resting. We're resting. All right. I, I so, would be surprised. This is going to end up being a long rest as well. Terrace. We are... Reluctantly. Reluctantly. Takes off the dead snake. <laughs> <laughs> and puts it to the side. Uh, where the other bodies are. She just like. Puts it on the on the other body. <laughs> puts it on the other bodies. Um, and she. Uh, returns to being small and halfling sized uh, and comes in I was gonna ask you guys 
what the hell you left me alone for, but uh, apparently you guys got into a little bit of trouble too. A little bit. Just, just a little, you know. Vampires and snakes and... Where, where did you catch that? Oh, uh, well, you know how you were checking this corridor and I was checking the other corridor to see what was up there while we were looking for the key? Yeah. It was just around the corner. Oh. And it was... It was a lot to deal with, honestly. It was it was a lot, a lot. Um, but, you know, there were just a couple of snakes. The other frogs didn't make it, though. Yeah. Rajima, uh, in speaking, sounds quite down, but says our frogs didn't make it either. Um... I think this is the first time we're actually hearing some emotion from Redeemer, which is going to catch Quinn off guard a little bit, because up to now it's been... there's been an assumption or an impression that Redeemer is not a... emotional being. Mm. You wouldn't be able to tell, looking at Redeemer, it's just no, in the voice, it no. does sound less yeah. less enthusiastic than normal, I guess. Yeah. Um, Kathana is going to, well, here's the, aside from Quinn, how's everybody else doing? I suppose I've got a, I mean, Terrace is only down one hit point. She looks fine. I am. Um, Redeemer, how are you doing? Redeemer, Redeemer's got a um, small scratch and that's about it, like on their yeah. armor. I think, I think Quinn's small. going to be pushing for a, a long rest here. That that was okay. How's... my question. Are we going to short rest or long rest? I, I think we we camp. DM, are we allowed to long rest? Yeah. We've Has it been long, long... enough? I was going to say I don't think it's been long enough. Is it? Yeah. Uh, you guys have been down in this place just killing snakes and frogs and vampires for like a long time. It's been. Okay. It's been oh, a while. I assume just so been a few hours while. at most. <laughs> In that case, it, does it... <clears throat> okay, so in real life, going to sleep doesn't fix all of your injuries, and you should go see the doctor before you go to sleep. It's a good thing it's d, &D. But, Right, so that's my question. Mm, Quinn, fantasy. if you have a long rest, are you going to be fine, or would it in any way assist anything for me to give you more healing before we have a long rest um that is going to be down to the dm's call as far as i'm aware i should be okay by the morning if something okay. has happened throughout the combat that i am unaware of that we're going to find out in the morning or <laughs> when we wake up or if we don't um, get a long rest because we get attacked in the middle of the night yeah mm -hmm. yeah um so yeah, as far as I'm aware, I should be fine by the time we wake up. Okay, and I think between me and Red Redeemer, can you? It didn't even occur I'll to me. Do I'll you need to like? Guard. Do you need to charge at night? I don't know what okay. you mean by charge, but no, I, yeah. I just I was just like vaguely assumed you were plugging in in the outlets at the inn, and then I thought <laughs> through that and was like, I was like well, there's no outlets here in the sewer, and then I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> No, I, I just it's need like to... like the 900s. <laughs> I just need a period of inactivity before okay. I, uh, I can... Okay. <laughs> I'm a time traveler. She's just like, just use your phone. <laughs> um, Redeemer's Redeem going to stand uh, a little bit away from yeah. the group, but in, in such a way that they can monitor the only entry point um, and will um, begin their sentries rest. <laughs> um yeah, uh, if, I also if, uh, only need four hours if that helps at all. But you need to attune to the thing if you're going to attune to it. Yes, I don't remember what we said about how attuning happens. Do I just like wear it as a necklace and vibe? You you essentially sit with it and are mindful and get to know it, how it works. You're like a pet rock. You're like, oh, name it. So pretty. Love you. Okay. Uh, the one I'm gonna... thing oh, to consider here. Childhood. Um, Redeemer doesn't have dark vision. How dark is it here? I feel. Um, I think I just has he give you, you guys, dark vision. I give you dark vision. All three of you have yeah, dark but it, vision. It it doesn't last forever. And if Tazzy goes to sleep, oh sorry, Kathana goes hours? to sleep. Don't I lose the dark vision? 
Um, well, it's every time we have a long rest. Up to three little yeah. creatures, 300 feet. Well, how long? 10 feet in front of you. <laughs> One hour. Sorry, guys. Yeah, that's, there's no way that's hmm. lasting the six hours I need to be mm, inactive. Might be. Um, but um, that being said, if I, if Redeemer was to stand like here, I'd still imagine but that I mean, even in the dark, here. not much could get past. Yeah, they can see and in here as normal. We could, oh, we've I'm also sure got a fire. We've got a fire well, in here, and I'm sure we could set up a couple of um, torches to burn mm -hmm. out in the hall to give a, a bit of light. I don't mind. I just thought I'd point it out just in case it was very much a case of like you know redeemers there watching the darkness and a snake just <laughs> slithers by <laughs> do you know what i mean <laughs> yeah honestly when redeemers just... like on watch i'm just envisioning a cylon from battlestar galactica <laughs> just <laughs> yeah that's kind of why i also it's as well like without without the you know but i think but very much like that or kind of like um you know a completely uh, you know, like a, um, a suit of armor standing in a hallway, and then yeah. as things go by, the head just moves with it. Just... I thought he was going to say Knight Rider. <laughs> oh, Knight Rider! Be very Knight cool, Rider was yeah. what I was thinking of with the this kit. Yeah, with the thing <laughs> here. I was thinking more like a suit of armor, watching stuff going by. You know, that follows people as they go by, and then as soon as they look, just straight position again. And then... <laughs> oh dear, good fun. Wow. Now. <laughs> Okay, so everyone has as much food and or drink as they want and or need. No sure. requirements. I have a question. Agreed. Given that it is that time of night and we are looking at a rest, do we find out now if we get a long rest or do we find out at the beginning of next session? It is a long rest. It is a long rest? Amazing. So we, can, we can press the button. Pressing yes. the button. Pressing We're the doing button. the long rest button. I like that button because that means I get spells back. Mm -hmm. I just got yeah, both Noel shapes back. I got my spells back and I got that Twilight Sanctuary thing back. Nice. Remind me about it next time when we start fighting. We all can get a whole bunch of temporary hit points. Oh, you know what I can't do as well? There you go. There's a, there's a note in our combat log. <laughs> That should be the first thing that we see when we get in next time. Oh, nice. There you go. Tidy. Okay. I can't tell my daughter that I let the frog die. No, you can't. Oh, no, you can't. She's a no. huge fan of frogs. Well, and, no, oh, Max no. is still with us. It's okay. Right. Yeah, tell Max is still Max. with us. Just just tell her we, we, we healed Max. He got back up. You saved that's Max's true. life. I did. That's true. You did. That is true. I did. So the yes, named okay. frog survived. <clears throat> the only named frog. The one that didn't have hungry eyes. Hungry eyes. <laughs> I mean, that one's still waiting for us to go back. <laughs> All right, ads are coming up, so I think we need to wrap, don't we? Yeah, I've got twelve minutes. Plus, uh, on top of that. Yes, we yes. did see the news. It's fabulous. It was. It, we woke up to it this morning. Um, but welcome in, Red Dragon. Um, Sorry, seeing as we're no longer in game, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that. So, so relieved. I also shocked. Uh, for anyone who's not sure, the OGL, which I posted into the Discord earlier. Cool. Some of the chat moments and clips are gonna be amazing. And thanks for all the I gifts I cannot get over well. how many clips we've had today. Yeah. Oh, I forgot I muted that chat. so many. Yeah. Yeah, and there's the... There's oh, the far out. 51 new messages since 51. I checked. Holy wow. cow. Oh, no, Troy. there's a gif of me. And people have been busy. Why did you have to do that? <laughs> and it seems one of way if it will load up <laughs> There is a gif of me, yes. <laughs> it's a good one as well. Troy, you don't have to apologize, honestly. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. Troy, if you fucking apologize, you're going <sighs> in the apology jar also. Oh dear. Today I learned Tezzy has jars of people. 
There, it, it's a thread. You haven't seen. You're in the jar. <laughs> All right. Oh my God, there's so many. I'm just scrolling and scrolling. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, Reggie muted. I think. I am. I am. I am. Sorry. Um, I'm just looking at who's 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 in my list that's in a category that we haven't raided recently. Um, and I don't have someone we haven't raided recently, but I do have someone who's very heavily into TTRPGs, is a really, really kind human, um, who would like utterly appreciate the raid. Um, and they're playing something called Escape Academy. I don't know what that is, so... What would you what would you prefer? Would you like me to stay in the in the D and D category, or shall we shall we go oh, elsewhere? Oh, the good people. Go to a good yeah. person. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Go to support the good people. Support the good exactly. people. Let's go. Yeah. All right. If somebody could run the raid command, please. Ah, <laughs> oh, they're nearly done. January's nearly over. Oh, that's and... not what we're laughing about. What? I, I, Ice and I are just like vibing on this brain cell right now. You just weren't even meant to be modding tonight. I have, look, this the game's over. Modding. We're allowed. We're allowed. To <laughs> in chat. You don't know how many times I've yelled at Tazzy for uh... one. For, for being, uh, for modding. One time. I wasn't modding. <laughs> I was just letting you know something. You were modding. You were writing in the fix it red chat in the moderating category. <laughs> Literally because modding. you forgot about an apostrophe I was English teaching. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I, 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 I got grammar jerked. It was just... Mm. Alright. Oh dear. All right, so grab the first message if you have a subscription to this channel, grab the second one if you do not, it uses the Twitch Globals. What we are going to do is go and raid the wonderful Stephen Joys. He is a lovely, lovely, lovely human who is heavily interested in TTRPGs. He plays a lot of indie games, he has a lot of variety. He's currently doing uh, a co-op stream um, with somebody called Sue. So we're going to go send some love that way. Um, so please do come along with this raid. We do play Pocket Dimension Pie once every two weeks. 